Dude, this track bangs. This is good. I just searched for nice Kirby music. Ooh. God, I love Kirby music, dude. Everything about Kirby is so good. Except what? The games. Thank you, Arthios. Oh my god, with the Prime. Thank you so much for the Prime, brother. Really appreciate it. There it is. Thank you so much, Arthios. Thank you, everybody. I'm back! I'm home! Hi! I've, I've tactically hidden my sub number so you all don't laugh at me. I'm gonna wait for more people to come in. Mr. Streams early. Hell yeah. So we got some stuff to go through. Obviously, the Game Awards are tonight. That's the main thing that we're gonna do this evening. Um, but moreover, I just wanted to talk with you guys. Said hello. Hello, everybody. Welcome, welcome. I'm chilling. I got de I decked up the place with boughs of holly. I did not realize how long this garland is. If you notice, I went all the way down the 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 thing, then I went back up, then around, then that way, then I had to go behind Ganon, and I had to go all the way around him, and then I had a little bit of time left, and then he went on to the cab. Also, the shelf holding Ganon finally fell over while I was gone. Also, okay, so my wife and I are getting our bathrooms done. Okay. So we're getting our bathrooms done, and while we were gone, our guy that was doing it, um, he's been coming to the house and, and redoing it and, and plastering up walls and stuff. So Mal and I get home yesterday at, like, what time? Mal and I got home yesterday at, like, 11 p.m., right, from vacation. And... We have to do everything to get the baby ready for bed, right? So we have to change her diaper and settle her down, read her a book, do whatever. So we do all of that stuff, right? And we both lay in bed, ready to just zonk out. Because it's been a, it, you know, like it's a fun week, it's vacation. But also, you know, we got a family. And I got a two-year-old at Disney, which is exhausting. So we do that. And we lay in bed, and then we just hear a... Hmm? What? So... My wife has a cat. Who's kind of old. And we look around for him. He's here. But we're also house-sitting two cats for our friend who is currently in South Africa. We were supposed to be done, like, two weeks ago, but she got stuck there because of the COVID variant, right? So we're house-sitting two cats. We look around for them. One of them is in her normal spot. She's in the loft. She's up there. It's fine. We can't find the other one. And then we realize... The fucking cat is in the wall. Our guy... Hit this cat with the cask of Amontillado. And he... Broke down the wall between these two rooms, went to Home Depot to get supplies, and casked it back up with the cat inside. Mm hmm. So we broke down the wall, which sucked because we just put the baby to bed and I gotta hammer this shit down. Uh, we put, we found out that's where he was. We were like, alright, there he is. What the hell? Because we were, like, looking at the vent, and we were looking at all the other walls in the house, and we eventually found him. And we put the food down, and he started eating, but now he won't come out. Because he doesn't know us well enough. So, we don't know what to do. Cat vented? I don't think this is a time for jokes. This is kind of serious. I don't think the cat was <laughs> behaving among us. <-ly. laughs> the cat didn't vent. I don't think the cat is suspicious. Is still there? It's still in the wall, yeah. Last I checked. I want it to come out. We have food for it. It's a black cat. And we can't, like, see that far into the wall. We know he's in there. How do we get him out? What do we do? Here from YouTube, first stream. Thank you, Dynakid. Hello, ever I thought you meant an actual rabid human baby. No, a cat. Why would a baby be in the walls? That wouldn't... I wouldn't be telling you this story with a smile on my face. Like, that's normal. 
If there's a fucking baby in the wall, I would be arrested. I wouldn't be streaming right now. I would be down at the precinct answering questions. Yeah, I don't know what I... That was bizarre. Uh, but Jose came back. He figured it out. Uh, and we're, we're doing okay. So, I... The cat's still in there, but the wall's broken down. So, whatever. So. Hi, everybody! I'm back after a week of vacation. Thank you guys, uh, so much for holding on to those primes for me. It means a lot to me. Of course, it's my fucking luck that the day before I go on vacation, Lug Ludwig announces that he's going to YouTube. So all those sweet, sweet refugees that need a place to call home, I don't catch any of them. <laughs> those poor folks. Where will they live? Think about the terrible streams and communities they could fall into without me being around to catch them. It's so sad. It's so sad. Listen, I, it's not about you guys. You guys are great. But think about all those cold, starving people out there longing for content. They're never going to get it. They're going to find somebody on Twitch that just plays video games. <laughs> no tier lists. No watch mojo. <laughs> None of that. Isn't that so sad? We have a hype train? Are you fucking kidding me? I want you guys to know I put the hype train at the hardest possible thing. I did. I put it to the hardest possible sub train and we I can't do it. I can't guys guys I, I can't do it. It's my first stream in a week. If I do it now, people are going to tune in and then immediately leave. I can't right now. I can't do hype. I can't tonight. I can't tonight. I'm sorry. What if people show up and then are like, what the fuck is this? Are we doing game awards? Yes, I'll put that in the title. Sorry, I should have said that before. You know you need the subs? I do. I do. Can I rain check you on Subula? Can I rain check you? As in later tonight. We'll do it tonight. Just not right now. Okay? I gotta talk to you guys. Okay? But thank you. Too bad I subbed anyways. Thank you. I owe you one sub. Well, I actually owe you a couple sub units, but this is added on to it. I gave you five rain checks. Yeah, but I'm saying I'll do it tonight. I even have the cake. Hold on. I'll do the funny character. Just give me a second. Okay? Thank you guys so much for the subs. I do appreciate it. Now, I'm going to show you. I'm going to show you my sub count. Okay? Please don't laugh at me. I've been gone for a week. I haven't been streaming at all. I also didn't even tweet. I tried to keep myself away from the computer as much as possible. Do you guys want to run predictions? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do it, do it. What's the what's the prediction? Over, under, what? I can't tell you. I can't help you with this because I know what it is. 1,500 over, under? Go for it. Go for it. Send it. God, I love this song. God, it's so good to be back. I love streaming. I really do. Hi, everybody. I'm in a good mood tonight. We're watching the Game Awards. Garfield just came out. And those motherfuckers didn't hit me up for a sponsored YouTube video. Did you guys see that? They hit up so many YouTubers to make a video on Garfield and on Nickelodeon. I never got the call, and I wonder why. Maybe I said it's because their game looked like shit. But it's fun. <laughs> I love their game. I do love their game. Don't get me wrong. Because I leaked Garfield? I didn't leak anything! I just knew! Come on! Of course I knew Garfield was coming. Any sensible person could have known that. How are you doing, Cody? You feeling well? I was sick, actually. If you hear me cough tonight, I promise it's not COVID. You want to hear me cough? Listen. <coughs> you hear that? Nice and thick. Yeah, I've been kind of chunky. Um, thank you for covering your mouth. Is that not something people do? Yeah, I, I was sick. 
I w I've been sick for the past week. Um, but I'm feeling good. I'm feeling good. Streamers never cover their mouth. What are you talking about? Are you serious? They just burp and sneeze. Are you watching Rick and Morty? I don't think that's true. Huh? Coney, please stay healthy. At your age, the common cold may kill you. Shut up. I have manners. I'm not just gonna cough for no reason. Broken well, eighty months. That's almost ten babies. You ever think of that? You and I could have had ten babies by now, almost. At eight babies is a lot. We'd be working on our ninth. Is this parasocial? <laughs> I've known Will long enough. It's a after 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 sixty months of subbing, it's not parasocial anymore. Then we actually are friends. <laughs> That's the difference between being parasocial and being actual friends. You just have to be subs for long enough. No, I love Will. Will's great. After $300. Yeah, you can buy the friendship. There you go. Thank you, Parappa. All right. Thank you, Sea Dude, the boss. Oh, my God. I'm seeing so many new primes. Thank you guys so much. Thank you, Long Nice, for three tier ones. Good Lord. All right. You guys want to see the sub count? Promise not to laugh. You promise? I know, I know, it's so embarrassing. I know. I know, I know, I know. Only 1,674 people pay me to play video games. I know, I know. I know, it's so small. I know, it's so sad. Only 1,677 people give me $5 a month. Oh! The shame. Thank you, lol nice. Hey, but in case you guys didn't notice, we got kind of lucky. Uh, we're one away from the goal, so, you know, you could be the one. You got lucky. We landed right on this one. Play some Hades. We can get it lower. Absolutely not. Absolutely not. Dude, at the Game Awards, there should be a stream poison category. That should happen. The game that is most likely to kill your Twitch career. <laughs> I think it'd be Hades, bro. That's funny. I was gonna ask what we're playing, but it's a funny meme show. Yeah, we're watching Game Awards tonight. We're chilling tonight. Um, I had some other stuff, but I th we've only got like 40 minutes to the Game Awards, so. We can make a bingo card, though, if you guys want to. I'm down for it. Thank you, soggy leftover french fries. Ugh. Cody, can you wish me luck? I'm going on a Twitch dating show tonight. I saw that! With Tanya? Tasha? One of those two. Good luck, brother. I wish you the best. Hades is really good. What are you talking about? No, 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 no. Hades is excellent. But it's a very bad game if you're streaming. Because it's, it's, it's what we call on the stream, stream poison. There's some games that I like to play that are fun, but they're stream poison because they they just kill viewership. And rightfully so, right? Like, who wants to watch some asshole do 50 Hades runs in a row? Unless that's your thing, right? Psychonauts 2. Kind of. Oddworld. Yeah. Are you excited for the Sonic Movie 2 trailer? Okay, let's catch up. Because, like I said, during my whole vacation, I didn't try to look at my phone. I didn't do anything. I didn't even respond to Garfield. I didn't even watch the trailer. This isn't a joke. 
I don't even know what he looks like. So let's catch up. Let's watch this Garfield shit. Let's look at this. So did the Sonic thing, is it coming out tonight? The Sonic thing is out tonight. The trailer with Knuckles biking for Guilty Gear. Oh, dude, dude. I actually did see that live. It's so funny. Watch this. This is so funny to me. Hold on. <laughs> so Panda tweeted this out. So... <laughs> so... I'm in the main room at CEO. Uh, I'm in the main room at CEO, and I talked to Jubaley right before this announcement happens. And I, I go up to Jubaley, I'm like, hey man, this is my first CEO, I've never been before, but I love the vibe. Uh, this is an amazing event. Thank you so much, dude, um, for, you know, for putting this on. It really is cool. And him and I talk for a little bit, and we have a good time. And he's like, hey, I'm showing something after, uh, after this. You might want to get your cam ready for a reaction. Uh, because it's going to be big. And I sort of call his bluff, and I'm like, Jubaley, I don't think you would announce anything that I'd be interested in at a fighting game convention. <laughs> like... I, Madge, I thought it was fact or fiction night. Not tonight, sorry, brother. I know because it's Thursday, but another night. But I told him, I was like, listen, I, I don't think I'm going to react uh, huge to anything you're going to show me. This is a room full of fighting game people. I don't really play fighting games, but thank you. That's what I thought in my head. I didn't say that because it would be rude. Uh, but part of me was like, are they showing multiverses? Maybe? But I was like, this Guilty Gear crowd wouldn't be into that. But instead, they showed something else. And it's so funny because... I'm in the crowd. I just finished talking with Kizzy, who just got, I think, third at this? Third or fourth? Him and Punk got, you know, third or fourth, I think, for Guilty Gear. But I'm talking with Kizzy and Alan, who's uh, CEO of Panda, my boss. That's me in the back. And, uh... <laughs> Biken got announced. And take a look at everybody's reaction. This is, uh, yeah. So everybody's going crazy. I'm just like, cool. <laughs> I'm, I'm just watching, like, how does she fight with those? <laughs> those are, those are big. She has back problems. Oh, God. That poor lady. <laughs> you know? Oh, good God. Maybe invest in a in a in a in a sports bra, you know? I don't know. But I'm watching. Listen, I used to play Guilty Gear, sincerely. I my, one of my first fighting games was Guilty Gear. I played XX because I'm old. I played it on Xbox Live on the original Xbox. I was a chip main. Not a joke. So I'm joking a little bit. I know about biking. What I don't know is why people give a shit this much. I don't know why Biken is this beloved. Um, but I guess she has strong, uh, uh, reverence. Uh, she has titties, so... Cool. Um, she's very Japanese, like, all of her stuff is very, like, Eastern, right? She has the writing and the, the, the cherry blossom, I don't know. Samurai, yeah, whatever. Vengeance story, very anime. Um, I like Johnny. I like Johnny and I like Slayer. Those are the ones I like, so thank you, Pancake. Um, <laughs> look at this guy top right. Yeah, he's going nuts. That guy's going well. I love Slayer. Slayer rules. Um, Johnny's the guy version where everybody loves him but hates fighting him. I don't know anything about their mechanics. I just know they're cool. I also love uh, Venom. I think Venom's cool as shit. Um, I was a chip Venom player, but I don't think I would play Venom in the year 2021 because I don't like complicated characters. <laughs> Coney, did you hear The Rock is in Fortnite? Yes, yeah, so am I. Hold on. Uh, isn't there a spot called Coney something? Coney, what is it? Coney Crossroads. Is that it? Is this it? Yeah, I was gonna make a joke while I was on vacation, like, yeah, 
me and The Rock just signed this deal. Can't wait to see how people react. Like, that was the joke of it. But I didn't want to look it away from my daughter at Disney World. That felt a little... <laughs> that, felt, that felt a little too... Uh, what's the word? Um, it felt kind of masturbatory to be like, Hey, look how funny I am while she's, like, riding Dumbo. You know? So... I tried to be sweet. So. Sue them? Okay. I was gonna say something about me and The Rock being friends and us uh, striking this deal together. But. Tony, you should watch Defunct Land's video on FastPass. That stream poison. That's two hours. Two hours of FastPass? Huh? What are you talking about? Why is there Garfield email? You guys wanna watch Garfield? Watch it double speed, even still. It's a good movie, but it's not a good stream movie. You know? I actually watched it. I I, I, I had it on in the background. I didn't actually pay attention, but... Alright, this is the Garfield trailer. I have not seen this. I don't even know his moves. Watch the showcase instead. Oh, is there a showcase? Oh, shit, you're right. Garfield. Is there one reference? There has to be. Thank you, Sterling Beats. Thank you, Zoinks, for the subs. I gotta go back to thanking people for subscribing. It's so cringe. I didn't use it. Thank you, Fat Cows. Thank you, Roses Mediocre. Thank you, Zinzo. Thank you, Levi Guy. God, I can't believe I had to do this. How embarrassing. Thank you, Dad Sandals. Thank you, JJ Slide. Thank you, Alexis. Thank you, Soup Guru for the follow. Thank you, Soup Guru. I'm thanking for follows now. Look how far I've fallen. <laughs> Back to begging streamer brain. I'm desperate. Until I get to 2K, I'm naming all of you. This is rock bottom. <laughs> Are we going to get to 2K tonight? Depends on if E. Compton shows up. Hey, everyone. Hey. My name is... Thank you, anonymous gifter. Thaddeus Cruz of the Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl Development. By the way, I'm in love with Thaddeus now. I'm in love with Thaddeus. This is my fucking guy. Like, I, I, I wish I knew more about him before the game came out. Uh, because this is my fucking dude, bro. <laughs> After reading his tweets and like, he's just funny as shit. He's very funny. I love him. Um, I don't know. That's my guy. Thank you, Anonymous, for four tier? What? How much is it? It keeps going. The number keeps updating on its own. I think it's five. Thank you so much. All right. Thaddeus had to come off his vacation to fix some bugs. All right, bro, hold on. How come everybody's always on vacation? <laughs> How come everybody on this team is always on vacation, old lazy asses? <laughs> come on. Why y'all taking breaks, huh? I'm a streamer. I get to take breaks. You know how hard my job is? I got to find... I got to decide if I'm going to play Mario Party or GTA every night. Every night I have to do that. Thank you, Retro Remedies. Thank you, Xandrite Live. Thank you, JJ Slide. Thank you for why. Thank you, Roma. <laughs> this is going on all night. Thank you, Alucard Yuki. Until 2K, I'm doing this every time. Thank you. Team. And today, I'll be showcasing the moveset of the... Damn, he ate a whole pie and the tin. He's so fucking hungry. Why is Garfield so much bigger than Patrick here? <laughs> How big is Garfield canonically? Patrick is a starfish. That's true. Coney, you should have gone on break in January for Ad Apocalypse. You know what's crazy? Vince and I are actually launching two new things in January, which is the dumbest fucking thing to do. We have two shows that we're going to do. <laughs> it's so stupid. Why? I don't know. Because we couldn't do it before. I was super busy in, in December. We have two shows that we're working on. Um, one of them, I, I've said this before, one of them is game related, the other one is not really video game related, so. Yeah. Thank you, uh, Stand, Standarsh4, thank you. Big thanks, big thanks. Thank you, the Pope 17 <laughs> I assume that's what that name is. Okay. I didn't realize Garfield was Nickelodeon. Hell yeah, brother! Listen! Hey, I called it! I called... Hold on. Somebody tweeted at me. Does anybody have the tweet? Somebody tweeted at me. I called Garfield being in this fucking game first. I was the first one. 
I'm not looking it up anymore. I'm not going to look it up. If you guys find the tweet, then, then tweet it. But I did call it. Seriously. Thank you, Tactical Mitch. Wasn't he data mined? I called it before the game even had data. I called it before the game came out. I had it first. Showcasing the moveset of the Lazada. Wait, did I make a bet for money? Who did I make that bet with? Yeah, I think I made a bet that Garfield would be the first character. I gotta look that up. Your loving house cat, Garfield. Garfield. Garfield is a lockdown type character who excels at keeping lockdown. opponents away while preventing them from running away. <laughs> when Garfield gets hungry, he gets mean. Is that his dash Let's attack? Let's begin this feast with Garfield's... Oh, he's an up tilt character. He's an up tilt character. Light attacks. Right. I mean, I guess they all are, right? Garfield's light neutral is... Forward kick. <laughs> it's time to kick <laughs> Odie off the table. What? <laughs> what? He said it? What? That is... That is... Oh, my God! Oh, my God! I love him so much! Holy fuck, I love him. Oh, God, I wanted... I, dude, I wanted him to do it so bad. I wanted that so bad. I wanted that so bad, and he said it first thing. I fucking love Daddy so much. Oh, my God. He's going into orbit. <laughs> oh, God, that's funny. I fucking love Daddy, dude. That's my guy. What the fuck is kicking Coney off the table mean? I'll tell you when you're older. <laughs> Thank you, E. Compton, for the 10 gifted. Thank you, Crossing Fate. I can't believe he said that. It's time to kick Odie off the table. Don't do it, Garfield. That's our pet dog, Odie. Forward kick. That's so funny. It's time to kick Odie off the table. <laughs> His Dude, if they could put the sound effect in the game, I don't know how they could do it, but that crack sound effect where he kicks Odie... Oh. Light up is. Donut bother me. Oh, that's cute. Every day is donut day. And his light down. Does Garf. Would a donut kill a cat? What can't cats eat? There has to be something that Garfield eats that he can't. Like, dogs can't eat chocolate, right? What's toxic to cats? Grapes? That's dogs. Cement mix. <laughs> I don't think Garfield has ever eaten cement mix. I, <laughs> I don't. Is drywall? Well, I hope not, cause that cat that got stuck in the wall, I think, got kind of hungry at our fly <laughs> swatter. <laughs> Moving on to the flies. Why does he? Oh my God! One, that's not a fly. That's a spider. But two, uh, that's swatter. cool. I like the I like the little things here. I like that. That's a cool touch. Moving on to the second course with Garfield's air light attacks. Oh, that's Garfield's cool. Garfield's light neutral air is... Happy Day! <laughs> this move has a large hitbox all around Garfield. It does. His light up air... Bro, that looks this insane. Move has a Look at that hitbox. What? Bro. That looks crazy. Then again, I guess it's like Zim. Zim's neutral air looks like that too. No. <laughs> no! <laughs> thank you, Dynakid. Thank you, Crossing Fate. Did I already thank you? Whatever. Take two. Large hitbox all That's around funny. Garfield. His light up air is. Thrashing Thoughts. The hitbox is. Lasagna. For this move is Lasagna. In his thoughts. Mondays. And Wait, is it random? I guess so. The hitbox for this move is. Oh, that's cool. I wish it was like Villager, where like the worse the thought is, the more it hurt. That'd be kind of neat. Thank you, Cole Rest. Very proud of you for three months. Well done. In his thoughts. That's and his funny. light down air is spin drop. Oh my god, he is Dr. Mario he hits down the opponent air. Multiple times while going down. Does anyone else have this down air? In the game? Wow. That's kind of interesting. Because I was going to say, like, I feel like I, I, I'm shocked that I haven't seen this before. You know what I mean? That's cool. By the way, look at this background. I just noticed Although the this stage. Although this move cannot spike, it's a great option to rack up damage. 
Wait, not having a spike in this game sucks. I guess you could edge guard with it. It's basically a spike, right? Because you just push them further off. <clears throat> Even if you land it, they die. They just die horizontally. Garfield's light dash attack is... <laughs> tap dance. Why does he have that? Classy. Bro, why does he walk like a zombie? What Nothing shows with? more love for eating and sleeping than Garfield's strong attacks. <laughs> Garfield's strong neutral is... Wait, when does he sleep? Is... Leg slap. His strong okay. up is... Lasagna Frenzy! Oh my god, a whole lasagna. He loves lasagna so much. The move has a small hitbox, but a ton of knockback. So it sucks. It's Patrick's. It's the it's the crown. It's not good. No one gets between a cat and his lasagna. Patrick's and going his pretty high. Down for... is no, 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 it doesn't matter. Classy shtick. Bro, let's go over. Does that have a tip? Classy. That is a lot of range. If you do that off stage, I guess it's like Leonardo. Leonardo has the. You know what I mean? Oh hell no! <laughs> Mario got the got the cane and the hat. The shtick. Wait, what is this gonna look like if he has a costume on? Does he still put on the hat? <laughs> Let's go over Garfield's air strong. I guess these are probably all Garfield's references strong. to like Neutral his. Air is. Uh, ew. <laughs> Okay, Thaddeus, uh, you've lost points. You gained points earlier. Now I'm mad at you. I'm going to skip forward a couple seconds. I don't like that. I don't like that. I might have lost viewers there. Guys, I'm sorry. That wasn't me. That was the YouTube video. His strong up air is... Yawn. That's pretty cute. That looks pretty strong. Right? Looks kind of long. I can see that. This move's hitbox covers his entire body. Sure. Pretty cool. And his strong down air is... Oh, that sucks. Air stop. Bro, all of his other moves are so long and, like, creative. Why is this one just... He's, he down airs the ground. That's weird. The attack deals a ton of damage. It has a fair bit of delay. Does not seem good. Garfield's strong dash is... Cat Pounce! Do it. I love how big Mar uh, Garfield's mouth gets. It's pretty funny. Now I want Charlie Brown in the game. I don't know why, I just want a Peanuts character now. Can that happen? I think the Peanuts movie is on Disney+, Plus, so probably not. We'll now witness a perfect combo of sweetness and aggression with Garfield's special attacks. Garfield's neutral special is... Pie. Pie party! Okay. Everybody has, like, a, a one of this. Every he single character has this. Pies in a set order. Two blueberry pies? Ten. And it always does ten. And a cream pie. The cream pie hits multiple times, while the blueberry pie has a lot of vertical knockback. Oh! That's kind of interesting. Thank you, jet lag pig. Guys, don't, don't say, don't be weird. Don't be weird. Don't be weird. Don't be weird. Come on. Stop. Use the right pie at the right time to set up some powerful combos. Oh, that's kind of neat. His up special. Is it ever worth <laughs> his face? He just remembered his time in Vietnam. Is it ever worth having... Like, do you ever strategize about which pie you're going to use? I feel like you don't. I feel like you never would actually do that. You know what I mean? I feel like it doesn't matter. Because either way you want... I don't know. Thank you, Ryan Sox. Thank you, Zip the Whiz Kid. Joel is Feral Cat. He That's leaps a cool high, upbeat. then dives down That's a with cool ferocity. Upbeat, dude. Land a hit right as the dive starts for a finishing blow. I like and the upbeat. his down special is... Pookie. Pookie. He places his beloved Pookie Hold on. for a finishing blow. I think I saw something. And his down special is... Never mind. Pookie. 
he places his beloved Pookie near him. Okay. Garfield can then, at any time, call for Pookie, who will fly back to him for a hug. Hmm. Dealing damage along the way. Strategically recall Pookie for a sneak attack that will briefly stun your opponent. That looks long. That looks like it'll last a long time, though. Like, that's a lot of stun. And finally... Does that spike? Why did he go down? <laughs> Look at and this. Finally... Why did he go down? What? That's so weak. I... Okay. Eh, Garfield can't be bothered to deal with the opponent right now. Aw, that's cute. Garfield's stage is sweet dreams. Oh, this rules. I like this stage a lot. This stage is inspired, dude. This is cool. I'm this a big is a fan. Large stage with no hazards and two platforms. I mean, it's clearly Let's just PS2, right? But who hasn't dreamt of walking donuts and flying rotisserie chicken? And now, let's partake in Garfield's all-you-can-eat buffet during a real match. Honestly, this team has killed it on uh, the f vibe. I don't know how to put it. Like the state, the aesthetics. Like, yeah, the character models in the animations kind of look like shit, but, like, the stages are awesome. I do think the animations got much better, and they look way better not in a vacuum. Like, when you look at them individually in a showcase, they kind of look like shit. But uh, for as critical and as rough as people were of the game, myself included, I, I really think it came out to a good game. Um, I think uh, it had some other issues that made it so people didn't play it for a longer time. Lack of voice acting kind of killed this game. I think that's the easy thing that, like, influencers and YouTubers say. Uh, and I think maybe it's a bigger deal than I, I think it is. For me, I don't think that was the issue. I think it's a lack of crossplay is the number one thing. Um, also, no single player. Yeah. There's some truth to it, though. No, I think you're right. I mean, there's definitely truth to it. Don't get me wrong. But I don't think it's the death knell that everybody talked about. I feel like not having voices isn't something that would totally, like, absolutely kill this. Uh, no items or FFA. Yeah, I mean, you got to focus on the casuals first, whether it's single player or just, like, free-for-all fun. Um, there are a bunch of different issues, but I think it's, for what it is, it is great. It's very fun. So. Cake in Garfield's all-you-can-eat buffet. During Voice acting does not fix match. crossplay. Crossplay is the main thing, dude. Fighting games yeah. need crossplay. If we've learned anything over the past few years, fighting games need crossplay now. Otherwise, your game comes out and everybody plays it for a week and then they die. Like, it, and they don't die, right? I mean, Strive is still fine, but it's like, they take a hit. Meanwhile, if you could pool all the players together, it gets way better. Get ready. It still looks so ugly. Three, I don't think two, so. I think it looks good. One, Especially go. in motion. I think the game looks great. I don't, I think it could look better, obviously. Boom, 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 boom. Boom. Ooh, big grab. Ooh, yawn. Garfield. They really showed him. Why did they end the clip here? Why did they end the clip with Patrick getting back? This character sucks. They ended the clip with Patrick recovering. This is supposed to be the Garfield showcase. This character fucking sucks. Dare, lasagna, okay. Belch. Okay. Does not look great. I forgot how much I love the announcer for this game. The announcer for this game is so fucking funny. You spike somebody and he just goes, Whoa! <laughs> Whoa. It's like my dad is watching me play. Dad, look at this really cool That's combo. Gonna hurt. <laughs> yeah, there's been no poopy play. Game. Okay. Patrick lived to 204. This is not the W you think it is. <laughs> you had to hit with Pookie at 204. 
to get the kill. I guess it's a good uh, reversal, right? Patrick was trying to uh, trying to edge guard him, but he had to hit that and then get the punish here while Patrick didn't go to the ledge. Cringe. Game. What's his win animation? Right. Wait, what happened to Garfield here? Garfield died. <laughs> Wait, watch Garfield here. Right here. Hey. Oh, he took a nap. Okay. <laughs> I thought he was still in the air. I thought he I didn't I didn't know he was on the, the, the glass part. I thought he just perished. That's funny. Alright. Does the announcer say his name? Cause it, it it doesn't seem to be any sort of consistency. Sometimes he does and sometimes he doesn't. It's very strange. What tier do you think Garfield is in? Not good. It, it doesn't look like he has a lot of up air, up air, up strongs, which is like the game. It depends though. Like, okay, so I haven't watched or played Nickelodeon for a little while, but when I did, it seemed like the meta was kind of annoying because uh, like Lucy would just spam down tilt hoping for up strong. That's all it was. You just spam down tilt and then you just up strong when you hit it because it's safe on shield and everything. Um, what else is there? Uh, Leonardo obviously just wants to spam grab and push you to the ledge. Um, the DI patch made that not the game. Well, I, did it? Because I, I, I commentated it at main stage, and it seemed like it was the same thing. But um, maybe maybe that was before or after. I don't know. I think he's high tier. Well, it depends on what your definition of tiers are, right? Um, he has good nair stuff. All right, yeah, if his neutral air stuff is good... They lowered DI again to 14. Wait, so wait, did they up they up DI to 16 and then they lowered it to 14? I gotta play the game. I haven't played it in so long. Maybe if I got paid to play it. Huh, game mill, hit me up. <laughs> That's not true. I'll play it for free. I like the game. Um. I don't think he looks great. The results are in, and the winner is... That's too much food. And no! that's Garfield. They, <laughs> they didn't say who the winner is. <laughs> I love it when they do that. Thank you. That's Garfield. I wonder what his lose pose is. The results are in, and the winner is... And that's Garfield. Did they not have it? He didn't say it, by the way. When is the Game Awards? In 10 minutes. We're going to watch it. Um... Probably sleeping in bed. Oh, that'd be funny. Like, he doesn't even care. <coughs> oh, I'm sorry. Good lord. Thank you, King Cannoli. He cries. Look up his lose animation. Is that on YouTube? Uh, Garfield lose animation. How do I even find it? Wah. Okay. Wah. Oh, that's cool. That's cool. Wah. I like that. Dude, I really love this design of Garfield, how they took it to the comic bit. Like, they they really wanted to, to dial in on the comic stuff. I think that's really cool. I love Thaddeus. I love this direction. Uh, he looks really cool. Does he look good? I don't think so. Um, but I was very wrong about characters in the past, so. I don't know. Not really a good judge of that. Although I did call Leonardo being the best in the game, and I still think so. Also, I didn't talk about this uh, before uh, because I wanted to avoid it. But on the last video, not on the last video, but a couple videos ago on YouTube, I talked about wanting a rant Sona because I thought it'd be funny. Somebody sent me this. I fucking hate it. Uh, MChili28, Matthew Chilton. Uh, he sent me this shit. <laughs> yeah, look at that. You want to see the full thing? Hold on. So he didn't send me that. Uh, he sent me just the image itself, and I made the I made it. Um, let me see. But it's got a full body. Um, where is it? God, my computer's so laggy lately. Shit, annoying, bro. Uh, I have to go through my um. DMs, which is why I'm hiding this. 
Oh, here we go. Let me do it this way. Look at this shit. It's uncanny. It's unfucking canny. Isn't that insane? It's uncanny. That's insane. <laughs> the problem with... Yeah, I just... This is... The, I just need a couple more so I can make a YouTube video criticizing media. Crazy. Too much hair? No, I had a lot of hair a few weeks ago. I got a haircut, so... We're good now, but... I think it was about that. I'm not bald. You think I'm bald because I wear a hat? All right, uh, Game Awards <clears throat> says show starts soon. Ta-da. Is there a YouTube stream? Because I feel like those are always faster. On the table. NFT. NFTs, absolutely. That's excellent. Good shit. Uh, okay. Uh, what else? What else? What else? Four-player co-op shooter? New one? A new one? A new four-player Co-op shooter. Got it. Perfect. Man in a blazer. I like that. T-shirt plus blazer. Uh, somebody with 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 formal dress with converses. Oh, he said no NFTs. NFTs, despite saying no NFTs. Thank you for telling me that. Out right now. Ooh, I like that. I like that. Out right now. Good. Um. Hype teaser into, uh, how do I put this? Into disappointing announcement. This would be like, how do I, this would be like them showing Rayman, and you're like, oh my god, it's a Rayman game, and then it's like a Rayman mobile game where you just, it's like, a, it's Candy Crush. You know what I'm saying? Todd Howard, dude. Todd Howard. Big Reggie. I'll give it up for Big Reggie. Serious segment on the game industry. Ooh. Serious slash diversity segment? No. We'll just say serious segment. If I could be serious for a moment. <laughs> there we go. Tech issues? Ooh, I kind of like that. Hmm. That's like, that's like, uh, hmm. That's like, a trailer doesn't play at right time. We'll just say that. We'll be a little bit more specific. Good. Jeff confirmed Reggie himself. All right, well then there we go. We got another free space. It's worth it. DMCA music. Oh, that's funny. That's funny. <laughs> How about this? I got a, I got a specific one for you. Uh, Giancarlo Esposito wins best performance, but isn't at the awards to receive it because he is a real actor. How about that? <laughs> it's pretty good. Actual sellout? Chris Pratt advertises Mario movie? No way. Esports player you've never heard of? Esports player you What's wait. Up, everyone? No. Welcome to the 2021. I like that. I like that. Pre -show. Okay, we're almost done. Oh, it's a pre-show. Completionists out there. They said 7:30. With exclusive content, awards, and not to oh, be missed. Oh, it's in half an hour. Or okay. you'll embarrass yourself. World premieres. I'm Sydney Goodman, and okay, as you on. can see, I am in person at the iconic announcement Microsoft of announcement. I like that. To hype you up for gaming's biggest night. We are live streaming around the real world and in the virtual world, thanks to Horizon okay. Venues with Oculus. No Silk Our Song. Main show Perfect. Starts soon and includes massive musical performances. Dude, good, good, some good, of good, the good, good. Biggest talent. All right, we got it. We got our, we got our thing. We got like our thing. Suicide All right, I'm making the card. Matrix one sec. Matrix Awakens and Destiny 2. But if there's one thing this community knows, 
It's that you don't have to hail from a giant studio to make All right, here we go. Here's your gaming. card. So let's start off strong with our first world there you premiere. Go. An indie action adventure that is as charming as its hero is cunning. This it's here, it's is holiday. Tunic. Oh, tu wait, that's not a world premiere, right? Wait, we've known about Tunic forever. What do you mean? What? It looks good. Yeah, world pre world premiere. I mean, I've seen all this. It looks good. Bro, do you think they're sad about Death's Door? Dude, I'd be so mad at Death's Door. If I saw Death's Door come out, I'd be so fucking pissed. No, that's my game. And now you just made it's it a time pro. for the very first award of the evening, and I really can't think of a better one to start us off. Hold on, Games I gotta change Impact. Bingo. This category highlights the very best of what gaming can be. Thought-provoking stories that challenge the player Before on your more eyes, than send just it. skill, Before exploring your eyes. all the corners of the human condition. Before your eyes. These are the games that remind us in a medium where you can be anything. Yep. Be good, or at least chaotic neutral. Here are the nominees. Why does everybody want to be chaotic neutral? Award. Everybody always wants to be chaotic neutral. It's so annoying. And the game award for games for impact goes to. Before your eyes, send it. Life is strange. True. Shut colors. the. Okay. All right. We're gonna we're, we're gonna not watch this tonight. Thank you guys for tuning in. I really appreciate it. Um, but we're gonna call it for this evening. Uh, was expecting a good show, but unfortunately, oh, his name is Zach. Years at a time before we share with the world, and that's kind of base. The world's often different from when we started the adventure. That's never been more true for me than with Life is Strange True Colors. It's not just about finishing a game in quarantine. I, who could have predicted what kind of an impact a game about human connection would make in 2021? So from everyone All right, bingo is up. Bingo Enix, is up. Thank you if you hit so exclamation much. point, bingo. Congratulations. You can get a card. Tony, you're not thinking normie enough. I, now, before we take I, a quick I, break, you know, I, don't I think have to console tell you about enough. Luna, Amazon's cloud gaming service that Do you? turns your TV into a gaming console. Do you have to tell now, me about you that, young lady? Amazon, they're a little indie development studio. I'm kidding. Uh, anyway, now for a limited time, the Fire TV gaming Bro, wait, is $40 what? Did I, off. Am I the giving everybody my card? TV stick, 4K Max. Wait, what happened? Controller, a high I gave everybody the same card. Luna. Get it now at Amazon. How do I stop this? Slash gaming bundle. We'll Guys, right stop, 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 more stop, stop, stop. After this. Hey, Game Awards, I'm Nate it. Hill. Hey, I'm Ariel Powers. And Get off my card. Streaming to you on Verizon's 5G network. Yeah, come check it out. We're going to party hardy until we can't hardly party. And there's going to be some surprise guests along the way. I think one of their names is Jack Harlow, yeah? I think one, yeah, one is Jack Harlow. All right, hold on. Jack I'm Harlow. updating it. I'm fixing it. So yeah, one come second. by at 5 p.m. Pacific. Everybody get and, a new uh, card. We'll be hold on. on. Twitch.tv slash NATO. I'm yeah, getting a new card. Hold on. Stop playing with that card. You're ruining my game. Risk of Rain 2? Why? You mean our card? Here, go, go, go. New card, new card. Yeah, this game came out a year ago. What? I mean, I like it. Okay, you now have a unique card. And it will take the full might of your tribe. Everybody, you now have a unique card. Yes, even them. Now I have a new one. I don't think. You are a Harrier. We don't have Tell anything yet, right? This very moment. Nothing yet. This okay. This I mean, indie game, right? No but pressure. that doesn't count. Don't show the URL? I don't care. If somebody wants to hack into it, they deserve it.
It's happening again? No, it's not. You guys all get new cards when you go to this link. Oh, wait. The Oh, no. I, I forgot. The bingo. The, okay, the bingo command isn't working. Hold on. Stop. Stop now. God damn it. <laughs> Hold hey, on. everyone, and welcome back. Thank God we there's a pre-show. We are so happy to have you with Thank us, whether God you're there's in a pre -show, person bro. or watching the stream. We polled Reddit's r slash gaming community to see what their pick is for 2021's Don't. Game of the Year, and the winner is Resident Evil Village. Wow. And if you're on TikTok, use the hashtag game night to celebrate the game awards. We are right, getting it's fixed, closer it's to the big show and people are showing Reddit up moment. early because the early birds All right, hit get bingo the worm now. Hit bingo they now. know better than to miss out on three of the biggest world premieres Listen, in gaming I think that we I, are okay. about to see. Psychonauts Roll deserves to win. It won't. That's fine. Resident Evil Village is a close second. KOF 15. Who the hell is that? Xanagi. Xanagi ne. Betsujin ni shite mota. Temei no tsura mite to irai. Right, that guy is over designed. Terry is just a guy in a red jacket wearing a hat. This guy has blue hair, red goggles, a red scarf, yellow shirt, a gun for an arm. You can't over-design a KOF guy. Yes, you can. That Okay, well, he broke the string. That's why I like King of Fighters. They're just normal people. Like, if you look at a lot of... K like, what is Blue Mary's deal? She's just a lady in a sports bra, you know? Get ready for a fight. This looks kind of cool. Use the YouTube stream? Yeah, let me find it. Oh, dude. Is this Texas Chainsaw Massacre? No way! Dude, no, what if it's made by Bloober Team? The people that made Blair Witch. Oh, God. Or if it's Dead by Daylight. No, he's already in Dead by Daylight. Right? No, it's definitely Ch Texas Chainsaw. Yeah, 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 yeah. Give me a real game. Give me a real game. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Give me a real game. Real game, not by Blooper Team. Yes? Cool. Multipla multiplayer. New people. Gun and Sumo Nottingham. Okay. No. No, that's okay. That's okay. It might be like Friday the 13th. I remember the card that's book. okay. That's okay. That's okay. Guys, that's Phoenix okay. That's good. That's good. I remember the guide stone. Don't copium me. The diamond Schultz. That actually might be good, you guys. The sisters of Balcora spinning a hundred billion stars. Alright, hold on. The song of the core. Bro, this is short. This is behind. I remember opening the gates. Whatever. I'm staying here. It might be good. You guys are so hateful, dude. It looks okay. There's literally no gameplay and I'm saying that. Wait, is this Chorus? I saw there was a game called Chorus that just came out. And I think it looks a lot like this. And Chorus has been getting really good reviews. Was it so long ago? No. Homeworld? Not so long. It's Chorus. It's Chorus. But not long enough. It's Chorus. It's chorus. Wait, it's not a world premiere. Did they say it was a world premiere? <laughs> I hope not. 
Oh, it's Homeworld. <laughs> Never mind. Chorus looks a lot like that from the one review I read of it. Never mind. Whatever, it's fine. This is just the pre-show, right? Yeah, we're, we're live in 19 minutes. And now I have the honor of announcing the winners for four esports categories. Then do it. For best esports athlete, here are the nominees. And the Check game it. award goes to Simple. Check it. Oh wait, no, I do know Simple. I do know Simple. And now here are I your do nominees know for best esports team. And the game we award give it up for goes simple. to Nadis Vincere. Congratulations, Navi. For best esports coach, here are the nominees. And the game award goes to. Okay, these guys have Coma. never heard. Coma. Okay, Congratulations, Coma. Coma. All right, where's and the. For best esports event, here are the nominees. Where's the. Where's the. There you go. And the game okay. award goes to. 2021 League of Legends World cool. Championship. Cool. All right, do we have anything congratulations, else? Congratulations, League of Legends World Championship, and congratulations to all the winners. I don't think I have anything else. And now we have three more world premieres in a row ready for you, spanning all different genres and niches. 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 And to start Bro, she's off, just like me. From the ashes to take their she's just like me for real. Royalty once again. Telltale she knows my struggle. It happens. To, that's ever. not a Coney bit. Wait for you to <laughs> this see. happens to all of us. It's so sad. She stole my bit. Actually, you're right. Yeah, no, she stole it. You. I know you've been a rock hopper. So you survived the crushing black of space. You work the docks on the series. So you don't put up with any bullshit. Among us. <laughs> You were Dawes' attack dog. So you don't have any problems killing inners or belters who disagree with the OBA. Is space like the theme tonight, you think? I've heard quite a bit about you, oh, Kamina that looks Drummer. Bad. It's hard to tell if it's all true, though. <laughs> truth is truth. How you deal with it. Is up to you, <laughs> boss man. <Yeah>. Yo, what? <laughs> Telltale Games? Hi, I'm Kara G from Amazon's hit show, The Expanse. <laughs> and I'm thrilled Why to she be say exploring like this great character further. She didn't sell now, me. The next issue of Game Informer. I didn't know this was a show. I've never heard of this. A, a hit show. I'm Cody, the hit streamer. We all have our reasons for Babylon's tower to fall. But not everyone has the power to make it happen. Yo, it's Elden Ring. Let's go. Can't wait. You do. This game looks fake. Yeah. With the Gideon coffin gives you strength. Powers. Coming soon to a bounty board near you. You know what's crazy? I have like four bounty board games, and I want to play so many of them. Oh my god, I have so many. I was kidding, but I actually have five games. I have Legends of Runeterra, Kart Rider Drift, which is a free Mario Kart game, style game, which I do want to do. We can play with chat. Alt Deus, Beyond Kronos, which is an anime VR game. Thunder Tier 1, which is, I think, a tactical, like, I don't know, an Albion Online. Quality? Listen, maybe I stay on YouTube, actually. Because YouTube is slower, but at least it's steady, you know? We want to jump over? All right, let me make the jump. One sec. Sorry, everybody. Is this chivalry? All right, we're hopping. We're hopping. Pretend like you didn't see this. Pretend like you didn't see this. Thank you, Jesso Hug. Thank you for the five gift. Ooh, thank you. Big thanks. Big thanks. Can we hit? 2500 tonight. Can we do it? 
Can we hit 3,000 subs? Is this not chivalry? Tripwire made chivalry, right? Thank you, stupid dumb dick. Is it DLC or is it new? Free weekend. Play now. Cool. And coming soon. I own a copy of Chivalry 2. They sent me one and I never played it. But I heard it's fun. <laughs> Alright, I might play this game. I might play this game. Turn off captions? Yeah, they're a little behind. Sorry. Alright, I might play this game, bro. This game does look funny. No, the YouTube stream is behind, but at least... Okay, he's gonna kill somebody. Mary Can't ship, miss. <laughs> is he allowed to say that? I have something for you. <laughs> what, that's how it ends? What? What's up, everybody? I am Ariel Powers, and I'm at The Game Awards. All right. Let me take you on a tour. That's the stage right there? That and guy's consciousness the was the only That's thing keeping it. that trailer together. As we'll soon as he got knocked out, out the game just. And Nate Hill tonight on his Twitch channel. Make sure you come through. It's going to be all over Verizon's 5G network. It's going to be insane. We have some special guests for you, so make sure you tune in and hang out with us. Okay. Bye. And now, guess what I have? What? Two more world premieres for you coming in steaming hot, Jeez. fresh from the oven. Let's take a look. So many world premieres, bro. How about a real world premiere, though? How about a real game? A creature wanders restlessly through the darkness. Oh, this is not... Silver light illuminates the land and the mountains. And with an entranced roar... Are you all over Verizon's 5G network? I, I have Verizon. I don't know if I'm all over its 5G network. You guys tell me. <laughs> There's a monster hunt, right? Leave the beast to me. This is a royal matter. Bro, maybe it's just me... Please make sure it says live in the bottom left. It does. I'm so sick of Monster Hunter posting, bro. We shall be in port soon. I don't know what it is. I know the game is relatively new, but I feel like it's been this out for eight house. years. Elgon. I don't know why. Like, I just, I feel like it's been out forever. It's old as hell, but it's new in the West. Oh, is that what it is? Okay. Annapurna, okay. Hey y'all, you've been reckless with other people's hearts for so long, Jala. It was a matter of time before you wrecked your own. Morning, Ma. Wow, Jala. Hi, Auntie. You pissed off your exes so much, they organized against you. Are we flirting? Or are we fighting? Come closer and find out. Only thing cool is about this Monster Scott Pilgrim? That they're doing a collab with Sonic. Emma. What the fuck am I watching? Oh, it's Jet Set Radio. No. Time to cook. That's acceptable. Cooking Mama. Jet Grime Radio Cooking Mama Dancing Fighting Game. You know, it's um Coming soon. Patience. Not for me. To Evil Dead the game at the Game Awards. And tomorrow <laughs> on Twitch's Winter Gathering, Jeff Keeley will chat with Bruce Campbell himself and Sabres Tim Willits about the game, which is coming out next year. Uh -huh. And now we've got the world gameplay premiere of another evil game, Evil West, which we also announced An last year game? at the Game Awards. Let's take a look. No! Not the evil game. 
Wait, Evil West, is that the what? No, there's Weird West. You know what kept me alive all these years? Upkeep, maintenance, vigilance. Of course, all oh, that means nothing when Hell's Gates start spewing shit everywhere. <laughs> what the hell is this game? <laughs> the butt rock? Western Doom? What the fuck is this? Let's do the bad thing. <laughs> He's a lightning god? It's gears, but Western and Doom? I mean, it looks funny. It does look funny. Ooh, you didn't see that coming. See, I was gonna say my biggest problem with Western you, games but is I that I am greedy for more content. Here's me a new too. World Always from Perfect Worlds. Always. <laughs> That's me. She's just like me, bro. She's just like me for real. I'm a little content mongrel. Ah, mm. Good morning, Death. What a lovely day I can't even day talk about the fucking games because they're coming so fast. Ready for another busy week in the afterlife? Oh my, busy may have been an understatement. That storm just came out! Evidently, your sorrows have been working overtime. Oh my, Wait, really? what? Wow, that is truly unprofessional. Now, Death, we talked about this. Try not to lose your temper again. I'm so sad. This is, it's Death's door. Maybe it's about time your subordinates showed you some respect. But let's see well, gameplay. You let's know see what gameplay. they say. If you want things done right, Hold it's on. best to do them yourself. If it's a top-down isometric Zelda game, we're in trouble. Okay. Pretty Hollow Knight. Oh, I added a new BTTV emote specifically for this game. I'm taking a look. I'm taking a look. Is that the name? I don't like that. Oh, it is. Okay. I I dig it. I dig it. Hey, everybody. I'm Ariel Power. The How did you get out there? We're watching and hosting a watch party together Wait. on Nate Hill's channel. Yeah, we're did... going to be watching on Twitch. <laughs> Bro, is this the same thing? Is this the same thing? I don't know, actually. It Come is? by okay. and check it out. Come through. See you guys. Bro, she's all and over now, the Game I Awards. I have the pleasure of presenting the Game Award for Best Audio Design. When your she's media all over relies the place, so heavily on being successful, somebody stop her. Does she have a pass? Inside your story, audio design is everything. It's the ultimate hint system, an instant mood that either alerts the player to what's coming next or obscures it. It's basically playing God. Here are the nominees okay, well, I was for going Best to say, Audio Design. Three games ago. And the game award for best audio design goes to Forza Horizon 5. Fine. I hate it when Western games aren't hey, just um, Western games. Yeah, thank you. You thank know what you, I mean? Uh, so much. It feels like Western um, games are always Western plus throughout something throughout else. The development of Forza Horizon 5 have just been so passionate about everything that they do. There's this relentless appetite to produce. By the way, muting this. Uh, one of the best Western games and one of my favorite games that I could think of, I love this game, is free on Steam right now. It's called Call of Juarez Gunslinger. Check it out. Seriously. It's very good. It's very good. Call of Juarez Gunslinger. It is free right now on Steam. That game is amazing. We have an it's incredible old, composer, but it's very Takeshi good. Furukawa, here to tell us more about his latest score. Let's check it out. World Hi everyone, I'm Takeshi Furukawa. You might have heard my music. I am most known for my BAFTA nominated score for The Last Guardian. Several years ago, I met with a new and exciting Never Swedish studio who shared with me their vision for a beautiful sci-fi story. The game centers around a heartfelt <laughs> relationship among us. between a young girl and an adorable creature. I instantly fell in love with the project and its stunning visuals. <laughs> Here's a taste of the game with the original soundtrack I'm working on right now. I hope you enjoy it. 
Okay. I'm going into this with an open mind. A game by. Ooh, I kind of like that. It's a nice intro. I'll give it up. <laughs> Analy Analyze is so funny. I love that emote so much. Yeah, I don't like the other Call of Juarez games, but Gunslinger is amazing. Star Wars ass game. I'm so reductive just looking at something and calling it something else. But you gotta be honest, that death game looked a lot like Death's Door which was a game about the Grim Reaper killing people and there was a lot of paperwork and bureaucracy. This isn't anything like Star Wars. Bro, there's a desert in technology. What do you mean? I'm getting mad Star Wars vibes. Also, it's about planets. And she's British? Dune? <laughs> Chat, you have two million dollars. You could spend it in either a score for a game, the trailer for the game, a designer like Kojima, uh, or hmm, marketing. Who do you who do you buy with? What do you spend it on? Because they're spending it on the sound guy. Here it is. I can't believe it. We are already here. We are down Score? to our final <laughs> world premiere of our pre-show. It is a special game announcement. Something you did not see coming. Marketing? I'll tell you if I saw this coming. Analyze. Oh, no. I can't believe she said this. Hello, the Game Awards! Oh. I come bearing news! Go away! No! After Persona 4 Golden, now you can check out Persona 4 Arena Ultimax and find out. I can barely wait to show you how everybody's doing. Persona fighting game? Doesn't this exist? This is a port, right? Persona 4 Arena Ultimax will be released for PlayStation 4, Nintendo Switch, and Steam. Wait, PS4? The Steam pre-order will be available very soon. PS4? <laughs> Analyze. Okay, everyone. <laughs> Where's it's the time five? for me to hand it off to our main <laughs> show. I hate to say goodbye, but I think I've earned a chance to chill out and have my <laughs> mind blown with incredible awards and exciting artists, performances by Sting and Imagine Dragons, Bro, how did they get by Sting Keanu on the Reeves, show? Carrie Ann Moss, Sting Jim Carrey, from the ben police? Schwartz, and yes more world premieres coming up so soon for our main show and i just want to say i hope what i didn't get Sting too bragging about here? how many world premieres we had but you know what i'm not going to apologize because when the best of the best of game development and production has that much to share i think we all win and when it comes to the game awards more is more baby i can't Thank believe they're making her read with this me at the pre-show and congratulations to the this winners of our first awards of the just night just spouting nonsense and that's it for me i'm sydney goodman i'm gonna go <laughs> find my seat the 2021 game awards starts now <laughs> pay out though listen don't get me wrong we did a surf start surf shark sponsorship and we have a lot more sponsorships coming I had to redo my bathroom, so I get it. Pay out. I am the monster you created. Oh, oh I didn't know you called me. What's up? Yeah, yeah. You ripped out all my parts. It's Sting. And worst of all, for me to live, I gotta kill the part of me that saw. I know. 
that I needed you more. I hope you know we had everything. When you broke me and left these pieces, I want you to hurt like you hurt me today. I want you to lose like I lose okay. when I play. play sting. What could have been? Let's play sting. I don't think she knows what to do. Alright, say goodbye. Oh, bye bye. Bye bye. Go to bed. Bye. 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 She doesn't see anybody, so she's very. Say bye. I saw somebody say, exposing her to Sting at such a young age. I know, I know, you're right. But what a good time for them to, to show up, right? She's adorable. Yeah, I feel bad bringing her on stream, but also I would rather do that and say good night. I got three in a row from DMCA. Is this DMCA? This is Arcane, right? I won't get in trouble. It's from a video game. <laughs> Dude. My uh, Arcane made me want to start playing the game again. Uh, and I'm really fighting the urge. Sorry, I didn't know it was that loud. Guys, no, I've been clean off league for a while. I'm going to keep it up. I'm going to stay strong. Don't worry. But my friend did uh, mention that he is a way to get um, hard stuck silver accounts. And uh, he told me he has an account with Malphite on it. And I want to play Malphite mid so fucking bad, dude. Malphite mid is so fucking fun. You just hit that fucking boom. <laughs> That ult, right in the middle. Ooh. Oh, I love AP Malphite, bro. I love AP Malphite. Oh. What could have been? You said you were playing Ari against me? You said you picked Ari? Ooh. <laughs> Fucking love that so much. Hi, Coney. Have there been any interesting world premieres? No. I'm kind of excited. I, I like the idea of a Texas Chainsaw game, and I hope it'll be good, but I have no idea. I don't know who the devs are either. The future, with all of its unknowns. Why don't we just go ahead and tell her that we're divorcing? My daughter is not. <laughs> I forgot woman. that it takes two looks like that. The fate of the free thinking world is in your hands. I know you've been meeting with her behind my back. It's not what you think, Matt. <laughs> <laughs> Life and death. Bro, that elephant scene is excellent. That elephant scene was so good. You can't just give up. We're never getting out of here. That elephant scene was amazing. I have been doomed to a life. Did you ever finish the game? No. <laughs> I think we got close to the end. But understand suffering. It will not be fine. It will be fantastic. What are the nominees for game of the year? Uh, it I takes two. Time to shine. Metroid Dread, Deathloop, Psychonauts 2. God gives victory to the lions. When I look into your eyes, I uh, see lions. Ari 8. Sorry, could you repeat that? And Ratchet and Clank. How did Ratchet and Clank get up there? What the fuck? It's so weird. Feel it? Yes. You want to stay a hater? I'm not a hater. It's just Ratchet and Clank is like the power of video games. 
It's almost like a movie. I'm breaking this loop. God. <laughs> RE8 is. I think RE8 wins. 2021. I don't think it should. Now, here's your host, but maybe Jeff I'm biased. Keely. Damn, Jeff got the normal shoes this year? Last year, De Jeff was dressed just like that, but he had some big ass Sora shoes. Hello, everyone. I'm Jeff Keeley, and this is the Game Awards Video Games Biggest Night. I love Jeff Keeley. What the hell are these, Jeff? Person. What are you wearing? It's amazing. Uh, first of all, wasn't Sting phenomenal? Yeah. So honored to have him open our show. That was what could have been from Arcane, the new uh, Netflix series based on League of Legends. Thank you so much, Sting, Ray Chen, and the Game Awards Orchestra, conducted by Lauren Balfe. That was absolutely incredible. Thank you, guys. Cool. Well, I got to say, it feels so incredible to be back here on stage at Microsoft Theater and streaming live to tens of millions of you around the world. Tens of millions? This is a night for the fans and you know the games we love huh? are nothing where amazing developers and that's why we Holy do this shit. show to honor Citation the creators needed. of games so welcome to all of you guys here today so good to see everyone i don't know who these people but, are you know, that they keep we showing. gotta be real and we can't ignore the headlines that are out there game creators need to be supported by the companies that employ them oh Oh, we're going I think there. We all agree with that. So let me just say this before we get to any of the news or announcements or awards. We should not and will not tolerate any abuse, harassment, and predatory practices by anyone, including our online communities. We all games love hotline. games. If we want this industry to keep growing, we must build an even brighter and more inclusive future. The games we play and when the, the games that we love, they teach us that we can impact the world around us. And tonight, I call on everyone to do their part to build a better, safer video game industry. Speak out online, vote with your time and with your dollars, empower these world builders who are creating the future of all entertainment. And believe me, the future you're about to see looks absolutely incredible. We got a lot of good stuff for you. Okay. We have so much news to get to. But now, to present tonight's I, first award, I mean, sure. please welcome a nominee tonight and the star I of guess Far that's the Cry only way you 6, can handle it. The one and only it just feels like a CTA, but it's like... Esposito. What is that? Oh, he's there? Oh, shit, he's here. Yeah, that's serious moment. Knock, out, knock off serious moment on your card. Independence allows a game to go a little bit more wild, become a bit stranger, and the freedom to break brown. He looks like he's having a Tonight's really good time, too. creative nominees for a best independent game demonstrate excellence achieved through great risk. Maybe he likes Here video games, bro. For best independent game. Far Cry 6 sure sucked, huh? Everyone, I want you to know, I thought Far Cry 6 was the first game. I didn't know it was the sixth game in the series. I played the other games, they're exactly the same. My bad. All right. If it's not inscription, we harass Jeff online. If it's not inscription, we har harass Jeff to the point where he uses that site. It's inscription. And the game award I'm about to tweet him. Independent game goes. It better be inscription. Kana, Bridge of Spirits. All right, I'm harassing him this instant. I don't care if he told me not to. This is an injustice. Are you kidding? I'm tweeting him right now. In a bridge of justice. Watch a movie by Disney Plus. There's a whole Pixar section if that's what you want to watch. I will never stop harassing Jeff Keighley for this. Um. Well, yeah, you know, it, it was an amazing journey to get here. Um, took a lot of hard work from an awesome team. A few of them are here today, but just can't say enough about the amazing people Insane. we worked on. Insane. Robbed. 
and to make the vision Robbed. come true. Um, have to take our, our partners at Sony, who kind of believed in us from the very beginning. They, they don't even care, bro. They didn't even the rehearse a speech. I've been there from the beginning. So thank you, everyone. And uh, this is a great honor. Thank you. Did you guys even play Inscription? I mean, our game was good, but yo. <laughs> Awesome. Congratulations, guys. All right. Now it's time to look into the future. Two years ago, this team I liked announced the third their of game on this very yeah, stage. Yeah. Now they're back with the first gameplay reveal. When I saw this, I could not believe it was actual gameplay. But it is captured by the team in-game this past weekend. It's among Sit us. Sit back and get ready <laughs> to experience a new level of cinematic immersion. Oh, it's like a movie. I could not believe this was actual gameplay. It's fucking... Among us, sir. And she said, Oh, that's funny. With our swords, we will forge new stories to strike the gods. Who's Ninja us. Theory? What do they make? They make Gaiden? Do they? Oh, they make Hellblade. That was it. Yeah, 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 yeah. You might see me as weak, but I will show you what lies behind my eyes. I remember seeing this. This was the trailer where the lady screamed into my face for 30 seconds straight. We will embrace our suffering, soothe our scars of grief, and break their siege of our minds. Heckblade. <laughs> you may see them as gods. <laughs> Thank you, Beta Cat. will show you what lies behind their eyes. Wait. Yeah, this is gameplay, I guess. Which does look good. Quirky depression movie game. I It's just, uh, you know, I, I heard Hellblade is good. It just does not look appealing to me. There's no way this is gameplay. Bro, they said it was, though. When have they ever lied? Look at the bones. Hmm? Look at the bones. That's going to be you. <laughs> That's chat. It's like streaming with chat. Look at the bones. That's you. That's going to be you in a second. You're going to die. <laughs> Analyze bones. That's kind of cool. I kind of like this. To win the war, we must break this siege. Break it. With an unshakable truth. I kind of like this giant orphan of cost guy. It. With an impossible feat. There's no way this jiggly motherfucker is gameplay, by the way. That's a cutscene. His ass is jiggling. That's a cutscene if ever I've seen one. Wait, is he becoming a rock? What? Oh, he like blended into the rock. Oh, that's kind of neat, I guess. <laughs> Stop rock posting. I mean, th this is a cool, 
set piece. I kind of like it. When does it end? I, like I mean, this is cool, right? I kind of dig this. Um, it's a cool idea, but it's also just holding up on the stick to walk to the guy and then holding up on the stick to run away from the guy, you know? The gameplay is holding forward while the cutscene plays. Yeah, these types of games just like, I can't get excited for them anymore, you know? I don't know. I know I'm being hate. I have no idea what I'm supposed to care about here. The lady! The lady who hears the voices. It does look pretty good. Why would anyone ever play this? I mean, it, again, like, Hellblade was apparently a good game. People did like it. What did Jeff just say about hatefulness? Cody, you're right. Please don't report my stream. Please don't report my stream. A lot of people made this game and built this world. You're right. Cynical Coney review. The Game Awards suck. This is your thumbnail. I didn't like the Game Awards. <laughs> the problem with making your video game more like a movie is that you can't out-movie a fucking movie. It turns into watching CG images on a screen. Yeah, I... I don't know. Apparently, Hellblade was good. I don't know. It's just like... I thought we were getting away from this kind of thing, right? Like, I thought everybody hating Last of Us 2 meant there was going to be a shift where people Truly were like, all right, these movie games are too that's much. That's not a cinematic. Not. That's gameplay, and that's why we do world premieres. I don't the believe you, Jeffrey. Because just keeps getting better, thanks to Ninja Theory for that incredible piece. And now, it's time for our first of many brand new game announcements at the Game Awards. Hell yeah. I hope you're ready. I hope so, too. Send me a good one, brother. Send me a good one. Uh-huh. It's not KOTOR. Bro, it's all space. Space games now. Wait, it might be KOTOR. I'm not a Star Wars fan, but I did like KOTOR. And I did like Fallen Order a lot. Jedi Fallen Order was amazing. I might be on board. Holy shit, she's gonna go blind. Yeah, somebody need to get her some glasses. These are very fine images. But I need to know what your game is. Am I the ship? Am I the drummer? Am I the lightsaber man? Am I flying the ship? Am I the gunner on the ship? What is my role? You can be anything. <laughs> what if this was a drumming game? trading card game it's Gwent oh I'm the goo I'm the ooze okay what kind of game you won't tell me, will you? 
No way. No way! What? What a way to kick off our game announcement. Star Wars Eclipse will be is the first game set in the High Republic game? era of the Star Wars galaxy, and it is being created by Quantic Dream in collaboration with Lucasfilm Games and is currently in early development. I thought David Cage was like persona non grata. I thought everybody was me. mad at Wells David Awards. Cage. All night we are partnering with YouTube Shorts. If you have a favorite nominee tonight that doesn't win, let us what know your thoughts mean? by posting a YouTube Quantic short. Quantic Dream makes with the movie games. Got shorted and head to the YouTube they make gaming movie Twitter games. handle to find out. Uh, they're usually very, very bad, but very funny. Consolation gift. All right, right now it's time to They make our stuff like Heavy Rain, Detroit citizen. Become Human, Program stuff like that. Back in QTE bullshit. To turn our air over to individuals wow. who are building positive, inclusive communities They're going to make a Star Wars movie to share their stories. in a game, but like a movie. Wow. I grew up playing games. games so much for that no as harassment as statement. As a little... A little gay boy, not... That's kind of true. <laughs> Jeff was just like, listen, don't harass anybody. And then the third game he announces is by David Cage. Quando eu encontrei os jogos, quando eu comecei a jogar, oh, eu man. acabei criando ali o meu espaço. That's the thing, though. That's why I imagine it's got to be really mundo. hard for, for Jeff to do stuff like this, right? To be inspired. To build up all this drag, this insane costume, <laughs> all this makeup, all this hair, but Bike it. powerful. Because as a kid, I felt weak. I felt like the outsider. Foi daí, daí que eu conheci o serviço de streaming e eu senti muito essa necessidade de uh, atribuir para minha comunidade coisas que eu não via, sabe? Essa visibilidade. Não, Is não this a video game? Que eu assistia. É, eu como uma pessoa LGBT. <laughs> Not dead by exit. fucking daylight. When you find people that have similar interests, you can be yourself. So close. You don't have to be worried about all these things that make you different. They can be what make you special. I hate by dead by daylight. Oh, it's Facebook gaming. Okay. It's a Facebook game. Name one good in the game. No. 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 Absolutely not. <laughs> no. <laughs> that looks like oxen free. Oh, it is. Cart. All right, I'll give it up. Cart shark is nice. I'll give it up. That's new new. Oh, it literally is new new. <laughs> I thought. I thought somebody just ripped off new new. That actually is new new. Okay. <laughs> I was like, what the fuck? You made Nunu. -nu. That's funny. Xbox commercial? They're in the Xbox. I, I see, yeah. Stop analyzing. What's in this Xbox? <laughs> Hi, folks. Oh, it's hey, this guy. Here. Todd Hor Howard Jr. Yeah, we've got some stuff I love on Pete sale. Hines. But let's all take a breather while we give away hundreds of free game codes. This is our small way of saying thank you for playing our games for the past 35 These years. are all for Fallout 76. And we're just getting started. From Ghostwire to Redfall to Starfield. And much These more. are all for we Fallout 76. That hasn't even leaked yet. So if you can't imagine doing anything other than developing and publishing Oh, that's kind of cool. We have a Pause the stream. I don't account. want any of these games. In fact, across Bethesda and all our studios, we're hiring. So consider this your invitation to join us. I don't There's want any of those games. Oh my god, look at all that. Running out of platforms Holy shit. And because it's not simple to give anything away for free these days, here's a bunch of legal text. That's kind of funny. Bro, those are all for Fallout 76. What if it's the same 20 on repeat? <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> you guys didn't have to pause the stream. You could just screenshot it, bro. Is this Monster Hunter again? I already saw this.
Hades 2? <laughs> that was an ad for jobs. Not a bad idea, though. I mean, if you want to get applicants, right? Once again, the chaos gates have burst. Oh no, not the chaos gates. Oh the man. Legions of Kazaros blot out the sun. Whoa. Not give in. Chaos? Did someone say chaos? Expect a bounty for this? Oh yeah, this is this is definitely coming to the bounty board. Yeah. And I'm gonna play it. I'll play an hour for money. Hell yeah. I'll play most things for an hour if you pay me. Most things. But not Legends of Runeterra. I've done it too many times. I've already done it like three times now. <clears throat> That was a new look at Lost Ark from Somebody's Amazon Games coming that. in February. And the speaking of Amazon, we're proud camera. to partner with Prime Gaming on Thank the Game Awards. This prime. month, you can level up your gaming experience Did with three games, gaming? Need for Speed, Hot Pursuit, Tales prime? of the Island, and Frostpunk. That There's reminds me of Twitch Prime, to play every month. which gives you a free sub games, to any own, streamer on the platform skins, for absolutely more, free. In of you Legends, might have one and not even know it. Why don't you guys go ahead and check below the stream, see if you have one. Prime Gaming. Oh, there we go. Thank you. Oh, the game you guys did that. The Thank you, Sh Sh Shadezy. Shadezy. Thank you, Frosty. There we go. Sure did. A little bit it's bushy. For a new game Nano key. Thank you so no much for the prime. Deezer Tauro. Deezer Tauro. Did I say that right? Thank you so much for the five primes. Oh shit. My daughter. It might be good. A new threat comes to our shores. Oh my God, that's a lot of primes. Thank you guys. Home. Holy shit. Is this Wonder Woman? What yes. Has been broken. You I already gave it to Larry Lurk. That's okay. Just come back in a month. You, you are a hero. It's not injustice. It's just a Wonder Woman game. Game codes don't you fucking work. <laughs> no, they do. They. It said it got claimed, right? You are Wonder it didn't Wonder say that... Dude, what if it did show a Wonder Woman trailer and they said it was Injustice 3? That would be so fucking funny. They make it look like... A, an action game starring a woman, right? Like a big deal, this big AAA action video game with a woman, and then they're like, they're "No, the it's a fighting Ellie game, and, and there are men the too." Part two. Please welcome Ashley Johnson. And Thank Laura you guys Daly. so much for the primes. I can't read all these. Gut score, newbie to Kenobi. I like that name. Virgil fourteen. Every year, the best performance category Thickest of all, one fine mister, Doctor Dre, Marcy, holy shit, characters. Tortle. Tonight's Thank nominated so actors continue this tradition, once again stunning us with their extraordinary depth and dedication. Here are the nominees for best performance. I think it's Juliana Blake, best bro. Best performance. She would did great. The truth about you. I've seen the worst parts of you. I, I, the death loop voice actors were amazing, both of them. Will be blood. I know it's gonna be Giancarlo Esposito because he played the he played Gus again. He's just Gus Fring again. Life is Strange is gonna win? I don't know, dude. It's the smallest game here. Was he acting? <laughs> he never said he was. Lady, lady might win. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bro, he's not wearing a mask. Maggie Robertson. Everybody else is wearing a mask, but not him. Giancarlo Esposito is like, fuck that. I'm not wearing shit. It's the vampire lady. Okay, okay let's not. Okay, I'm gonna wait till she's on stage. Um, wow, that was the scariest walk I've ever done in my life. Um. Thank you. Don't so analyze, much. Chet. An Stop analyzing. Don't analyze. Stop analyzing. I would like to give a really huge thank you to Capcom for creating an amazing game full of wonderfully rich and 
She deserved it, though. Uh, she did deserve it. Is but one. She did deserve and it. She did a great Rosanna job. And DJ with the workhouse, to Steve Knievel, she did a great job. Cinematics director. I've said this before, but I'm going to say it again because I'm a broken record. I'm going to lose you viewers if I stay up there. You took a chance on me <laughs> when you hired me for this role, and in doing so, you have changed my life. What a tall lady. Being a part of this game, playing this role, and becoming a member of this amazing community has changed my life, so thank you She's so, so actually much. very tall, too, right? Good for her. She did a great job. Yeah, she that was a she did great in the role. Although the audio quality sucked. That's not her fault. That's the audio designer. But I remember her voice clipping, and I'm like, what the fuck? Oh hell yeah, I'm bought in. We all come to a story with hopes and expectations. Looking for an answer. Don't be dead by daylight. Every time I see a horror game, I think it's dead by daylight. Co-op shooter? Sometimes it would be better to live with that hope. Without ever finding the story. Please be good. Not blooper team. Not blooper team. Not blooper team. Be good. This is not the story you want it to be. It's gonna be good. Is it Silent Hill? It's not Silent Hill. It's not Silent Hill. What am I saying? It's not Alan Wake. Will eat you alive. It's Alan Wake. Right? This story is a monster. I thought he was gonna say he's among us. Is it evil within? Where many faces. <laughs> Alan asleep. Oh, that is Alan Wake. Okay. Keanu Chunkus, shut up. That's not Keanu Reeves. Gotcha. All right. I'm now joined by my you man, Sam me. Lake. Sam, thank you. Coming all the way over for Finland for this. Uh, this is so exciting. Alan Wake 2. It's been cool. a decade. Fans have been asking you for it. Why is now the right time to bring him back? Well, Jeff, first of all, I want to say apologies. It's been raining here in Los Angeles today. <laughs> it's on us. I was like gonna fiction, say. <laughs> fiction leaking out oh, into reality. So funny. sorry. <laughs> anyway, yeah, 10 years, over 10 years. Uh, one thing to make that's the this real streaming Max of Payne, making guys. it, we've been iterating on the concept, and we know fans now, have though. been asking for it. We've been a bit protective. We knew he looks evil. this is going to be a pretty Swedish. scary experience. I was but say. now we are convinced everybody is ready. What, you are ready. What kind of game are we going to get for the Swedish? sequel? Can you tell us something about it? Yeah, we are breaking new ground here. This is going there. to be Remedy's first ever Helsinki. survival horror Finland. game. Ooh. No, I'm horror in trouble. On the genre. No! Uh, the first game had horror elements to it, but it was They're finished. Yeah. I'm finished. We feel that this is the perfect genre to bring together the story and gameplay closer than ever before. Because the story, horror story, is at the very heart of this, and it's psychological, Alan Wake was a good layered, game. deep mystery I to dive wait. into. It was a little strange. You know, you strange, are such an incredible visionary. I can't wait to see what you're doing with this game. I'm excited for this. This was your dream project, and I'm so honored. Al I heard Alan Wake was good. At the game I don't think so it we're aged more well. Next year, uh, but think, Alan right? Wake was yes. good. We, you know, like, it's interesting. The theme. Yes. We're gonna go dark. Okay. It's very interesting to work on this. We'll be back next year. Summertime. Okay. Uh, it's not coming out in 2023. All right. Summer 2022. <laughs> more on Alan Wake 2. Sam, thank it you so good much ideas. for that yeah. thank you. Jeff Very is definitely exciting. trying to hurry right. him. Yeah. Well, now I'd like Jeff's to trying to push him along. Comedian, writer, and a well-known chili dog enthusiast. It's Ben Schwartz. I'm coming. <laughs> everybody that is going on Twitter right now. That's going on Twitter right now. I'm coming. <laughs> Everybody, my name is Ben Schwartz. I played the voice of Sonic the Hedgehog in the Sonic the Hedgehog movies. Thank you. That's very kind. All right, thank I got to pee. I need much. a bad trailer. Uh, and I just wanted to say so thank you so much for supporting our movie. Also, thank you very much for the note about Sonic's legs and teeth in our original trailer. <laughs> That, no, for real, that's a good note. That's a good note. I'm really happy that's that funny. worked out. We needed that. We really needed that. The good news is, so that's many of good. you loved our first movie that we got to make a sequel. And today, yes! Video that was game a pretty movies, good movie. On. That was a pretty good yes. movie. Harassment worked? Sure. Two other people at the end. Harassment today, works! I True! I me the trailer <laughs> to that sequel. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I mean, this is you can. This isn't like the real trailer. This is a blank DVD That's for funny. effect. If this was the real trailer, I feel like uh, we, we'd be screwed because there's no computer with a DVD drive anymore. So this would be like troublesome. 
Anyway, I can't tell you how excited <laughs> we all are about Sonic 2. So many incredible people are in this movie. We got you just James have to Martin, find the right people Tika to bully. Sumter, That's what it is. Colleen O'Shaughnessy. Don't, don't bully tails. streamers. Bully movie Idris studios. Idris Elba as Knuckles. And, of course, the legend Jim Carrey as Dr. Robotnik. He said Robotnik, Now, Jim has Eggman actually sent based. a very special video over to say hello to all of you, and you guys are in luck, because I have the video with me right here. <laughs> oh, callback! I'm happy. Just kidding. This is blank still. Let's roll the video, Jim. That was what pretty funny. That was a good bit. Hello, everyone, and hello, Ben. I'm sorry I couldn't be there with you, but I look forward to meeting all of your avatars where in the he? metaverse, where we can really get to know each other. Hey, before you see this exciting new Sonic trailer, mm -hmm. I'd like to pass on a word of advice that my Scottish grandfather gave to me when I was just a boy. He said, son, don't grade it in the grinder. Don't do it, son. Don't grade it in the grinder, boy. Grade it, by all means, grade it till the cows come home. This is the next but 20 don't minutes. don't grade it in the grinder. And then to drive the point home, he put his hands around my neck and he squeezed real hard and he said, Don't do it, son! Don't grind it and the grinder! It just goes Are on for 20 minutes. To me, boy? The crowd gets left? increasingly more uncomfortable. Wow. Yeah. Inspiring words. Thank you, Jim. You know, I think we all needed to hear that. Yeah, take it in if you need to. Good? Great. Okay. Here we go. Thank you again for continuing to support the Blue Blur, and it is my Was honor to present to you the trailer for <laughs> Sonic the Hedgehog you did something 2. something to that camera Enjoy. guy. Quick stretch, little snack, and here we go. Sonic, I love that you want to help make a difference. Mind if I drive? No. Being reckless. Don't worry. Nobody You're a loose it. cannon, Sonic. Pretending to be Batman. Blue Justice, trademark pending. You're still just a kid. Trust me, there will come a moment when your powers will be needed. But you don't choose that what moment. The fuck? That moment chooses you. I just got goosebumps. Wait a second, did you steal that from Oprah? What the fuck? <laughs> How did he get all that technology? Got a brand new stash. He was on the Since mushroom gone, I've discovered the source of ultimate power. That sounds big. It's been on my vision board for years. Hope I'm not too late. Oh, I hate I'm it. Sorry, I hate you? it. Name's Tails. Okay. He sounds like the little kid TTS. Do. Step one, light taunting. Step two, I have no idea. I don't like it. That's the same BO. I don't care. <laughs> that wasn't too bad. <laughs> I don't care. I hate it. That's how Tails sounds. I don't care. I hate it. Return to sender. Face it. You're never going to get my power. Wow! Oh, I look like I need your power. Oh, he's not British! Where are my manners? Sonic, meet Knuckles. Oh, that's cool. Okay. One, he's not British. Thank God. Two, they're actually doing like the he's Robotnik's friend. That's cool. So, so okay. Fun. I didn't right. know if they would actually Next, do that. One of your nominees tonight for most anticipated game is Horizon Forbidden West from Gorilla Games. I thought they would just the make him a good guy, but no, they're doing the more. Okay. Finishing it up for a February release, but I'm it looks good. they put together this for the fans. That looks good. And he didn't chuckle once, which is true to his character. The land is dying. I hate and the way Aloy speaks. She sounds so strained in everything she says. 
It's the most important words ever uttered. It's Ashley Birch? Yeah, but it's not even, like, her v voice, because she's a good voice actor. It's just the way she delivers this character, you know? She lives a stressful life, true. I'm excited for this game. I loved this game. This is better Breath of the Wild. If you haven't played this game, try it. It's Breath of the Wild, but, like, with good combat. Not a joke, seriously. Not a joke. It's not bait. I liked... This is basically Breath of the Wild, but I liked it way more. The com... It's... It's... I think it's less charming than Breath of the Wild. It has less of that Nintendo whimsy. But the gameplay itself is good. The combat's excellent. Oh, there's your orchestra. <laughs> Alright, they're gonna play music, and I'm gonna go pee. Don't leave, though. Don't leave the stream. Don't leave. I'll be right back. I had to go back. By the way, <laughs> I saw Star Destroyer tweeted out a picture of the Discord. And as soon as Lady Dimitres wow, showed up, everybody in the thank Discord just said, so she's much. real. I am so ready for this game. Uh, thank you so much <laughs> to Lauren and the orchestra. And in her first ever performance funny. and trip to the United States, the beautiful Julie Elvin. Thank you so much, Julie. <laughs> Well, I did music watch. Last week, you missed so many trailers. Their Spotify wrapped on social they media. They gotta stop doing My that, bro. My top artists of 2021, Rufus DeSoul, Sam Fender, and Dayglow. You can make your Spotify Ooh. wrap now in the app and stick around as we He's reveal a hipster, for the first bro. time the most listened to Spotify artists and songs on gaming consoles in 2021. Also on the music front, some of the music we've been playing tonight is from Sessions Diana. Sessions is Riot Games project with music made to be safe to stream without fears of copyright. They got crushed issues. by the giant Check out snake. Sessions. Dot Riot Games Why is the full album. What's and going now on there? It's time for a special and long awaited announcement. Yeah. Cloud, let us defy destiny together. Is it Fortnite? Gonna drop plate number seven. You're gonna do what? What the? I was gonna say, is Sephiroth in Fortnite? It's just FF7 Remake on PC? Uh, I thought it already was on PC. Is it not? I thought it was on Steam. It's part two? It's not part two. If it was part two, they would do a bigger trailer. It's not part two. If it was part two, it would be a way bigger trailer. Also, they just spoiled the ending. Surrender to the darkness. Embrace it. I thought it was on PC. Okay. Cool, I guess. It was a good game. Cool. Yeah, yeah. Hundreds of games to choose from. Oh my PC. god. Oh, you a player to do some. I know it's ironic, but I still hate it. I, I know it's ironic. I just... Xbox Game Pass for PC. 2021 Game Awards, Xbox Game Pass for PC, and you two. What do we think? Uh, you know, it's so effortful. I like that we animate it. You're welcome. Okay, I understand the impulse to do something big, but what do PC gamers actually 
want? Because I don't think it's that. They love brand new PC games. We have some great ones coming day one. Okay. Some of them haven't even been announced yet. Okay, great. Marketing idea. What if Gator tweets out this list, more or less leaking it, in a cool, hip way? I retweet it because I have so many more followers than him. It's done. What's done? Tweet it. It's out there. No, you didn't. I don't what? think you should have done Proactivity that. ain't a crime, man. We'll no, figure it might it out. Be. When people think Who about Xbox it? Game Pass, they think what about was his console. Name? They don't know we're a PC gaming service. Why not just call it PC Game Pass? That's a great idea. Really good. God dang. Okay, we're going with that. Just like that, you're gonna change the name of the whole thing because of Gata, who calls himself Gata. It's a good name. All we gotta do Gata. is add some top-tier streamers to this to really land it. Gata, yes. What about I have a big announcement, thieves? guys. I have big a big fans. announcement. Was that a uh, hundred thieves? Where are the other 97? I get it. That's fine. Thank you, man. We'll take it from here, brother. We got cameos, we got ideas percolating, right? Next steps to me or just talking about like how we bill you? I'm not. Wait, 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 hold on. Are we really gonna make an ad for the Game Awards and you're not gonna rap in it at all? I mean, if I could what? get away with that. Game Pass has PC games. Yeah, we do. So this is an awareness ad. I guess that's kind of like saying we're at the, the Game Awards. Yeah, yeah, PC Game Pass. Dude, I like that the meta is now just giving out game passes. That's neat. I mean, that was a fine commercial. It's fine. It's a it's an awareness play because people do not realize that Game Pass has that. Mobile games. Android has games. Nintendo Switch does have games. It truly does. As we can see here. Look at the games. Hello Game Words. My name is Martin Foss Anderson, aka Mr. Savage. It's really bad if you're if you're stressed before you're trying to play a game and trying to win it. If I was stressed after school, I just wouldn't be able to focus properly and it would just make everything 10 times harder. Together with Truth, I have an important message. Vaping nicotine can increase anxiety symptoms. Don't be stress stressed. Levels. I think it's really important to people know the Breathe, truth about bro. vaping nicotine. All right. Thanks, Truth. <laughs> Bro, I'm so sick of lo-fi hip-hop. I know I'm a hater, but I just, I, I feel like it's so, it's the new, it's the new electro swing. You know what I mean? You guys remember that when everybody was doing Caravan Palace? I'm a hater, bro. I'm such a fucking hater. I gotta stop. I'm so hateful. Wait, Prime? Prime? Like Prime Gaming? Prime Gaming? That lets you get a sub now, for free on your stream. All you have to do is go below the stream and see if you have one. There's a little button that says continue sub or try sub, and you can subscribe for free. Maybe one of you guys have Prime Gaming right now. Why don't you go ahead and check? And hey, if you want to use it here, that'd be kind of cool, right? Huh? Anybody? Oh, hey, guys. What's Thank up? you, Gamer302. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Thank you, Predator Toner. Thank you. Sorry, um, I'm I'm uh, here to present the Game Award for Best Action, I guess. Uh, and oh shoot, that's so sick! <laughs> sorry, 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 sorry. Um, so you know, as a martial arts superhero myself, uh, I, I know a little thing or two about action. And uh, oh, he's snap, watching this stream. Sword. Mm. He's watching us right now, guys. Sorry, he's so, here. Um, where was I? Prompter, right? Uh, uh, action. Everybody say hi. When it's kinetic and and fast paced and he and, just and totally subbed with Prime. To the, That's so to, uh, sick. No, you did not, Master Chief. Oh, you didn't. <laughs> Sorry, guy. Look, you guys know that Halo just came out, right? True, but don't leave the stream. Don't leave the stream. I didn't want to tell you guys. I, I gotta be here. Uh, so so instead of actually. 
playing Halo on, I'm leave. on stage presenting the game award for best action while watching streamers on Twitch. <laughs> Seemed like a pretty reasonable compromise. YouTube gaming is molding. Anyway, here are the nominees. Seething currently. They didn't pay him best enough. Action game. Bro, okay. What should win? What should win is Returnal. Because Returnal gameplay, I think, is the best out of all of these. What will win? Is Resident Evil on here? A revolution is not won by the fearless. Deathloop? I don't know, dude. Deathloop, I thought. Returnal, I thought, had the best gameplay. Returnal was amazing. Maybe Deathloop? I don't know here. This one's tough. Sorry, sorry, sorry. It can't uh, be Far Cry, the right? The Game Award for Best Action Game goes to... I hope it's Returnal. I love Returnal. Returnal. Yes! We got one! Hell yeah. Good shit. We got one. Lock it in. No, dude. Returnal's very fun. Uh, the story is some crazy nonsense about spoilers. A woman who, like, drove off a bridge and her daughter died and she feels bad about it, and the whole game is trauma or something? I don't know. Um, the story is silly. But the game itself is extremely fun. Very hard, though. Wow. <laughs> Thank you. Massive spoilers? Uh, Listen, I'm, I'm gonna so tell you so you don't have to play. To award, trauma uh, time loop. Who worked on Returnal. Uh, when I first joined Housemark, Returnal should I be a game Returnal of the year? Hold on there, really fella. Game. Hold on, analyze. And it was our amazing team that pulled it off and brought you the game that you play today. Uh, thank you to the amazing Child team at Trauma Housemark Double A Finland, Game. Our incredible co-dev partners yeah. who helped us build Returnal. Uh, our amazing partners at XDev, represented by Pedro, and uh, everyone at PlayStation. My We're trauma so manifests as a PC90 like dating sim. Uh, but biggest thanks, obviously, has to go to the players. Thank you for playing, and uh, thank you for supporting Returnal. Wonderful. What's your trauma game, chat? Bro, I would bring note cards. I don't want to miss anything. If I want to thank people, you know, that's important to me. I, I would bring note cards. He's based for that. Space again, by the way. It can't be. It is. Just start at the beginning. It looks and sounds like Mars. control, but this doesn't seem it like control. Wrong. Like we were in a dream. Ooh. And you, boarded you know what's weird? This looks we better to me because she's using door. a pistol. Yeah. Oh, it's we Destiny? Never mind then. I don't care. Try to gain the upper hand. I thought sh Too shooting with the enough. pistol looked better. Because it looks very, like, you know. But if it's Destiny, I don't know. Uh, I sleep. Bro, I love revolvers and pistols in games. What I love that next? shit. My ghost brought me back. We kept going. She knew we would. And that's when you saw the night. I'll never forget it. They called him the Fight Knight. Destiny 2 is the shittiest game on the planet. Yeah. Have you played at Dead of Night? The current belt holder for the worst game we've ever played on stream. Thank you, Banana Man. Thank you, Pochu, SSBU. Thank you, Sora Thelfi. Hey, if you're sad because I didn't thank you, it's totally... Listen, I get it. I understand. Screen Man will say your name. All you gotta do is drop a sub. That's all. I'll do it. I'll do it right now. Just right now. To know what that thing was. Bro, this is a long ass trail. Tony's the kind of guy to like pistols and revolvers in case. What does that even mean? What does that mean? Thank you, Exalted Mom. Thank you, Fella Artois. I'll keep saying names until this trailer ends. This is taking too fucking long. <laughs> it's Destiny 2. Yeah. Thank you, Foxy Aibot. Thank you very much. 
looks so so good. All right, no more uh, subs. No more subs. That is coming out in February. And everything you saw there is actually from the uh, the first mission of the game, which is so cool. And Bungie is celebrating their 30th anniversary this year. So uh, congratulations to Bungie. And there's a lot of great stuff Bro, happening. That's crazy. Right that Bungie is now, in Halo to celebrate anymore. 30 years of Man. Bungie. Um, all right, now it is time to uh, get to another new game really announcement. Uh, a few months ago, a uh, Japanese game creator reached out to me and said, hey, I want to announce my next game at the Game Awards, and I'm so honored to it's have Kojima, this opportunity to it? present this he global Kojima. announcement to all of you. Please enjoy. He said a Japanese game creator, and he loves Kojima. Wait. Oh my god. I do love a Kyrium open. It does look okay. No, I mean, it does look okay. That's a fun one. It's clear Toy Amazon has not abandoned his roots. Uh, thank you again for it that. It does look okay. It just... Speaking I want, of, I love uh, that, uh, we have another brand new I game love Silent Hill. I love Silent Hill games. Comprised of many industry so veterans. that's what I Check thought it out. was. But that's fine. It'll be it'll be good. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. You can't name drop Silent Hill and announce a game like that. Yeah, kind of. It's just it's a different vibe, you know. What is she wearing? <laughs> that can't be good for combat. What the fuck is that? <laughs> Oh, that's cool. It's a neat enemy design. Bro, is it Monster Hunter again? Ever since the day the portal network collapsed, strangers oh, portal. in these realms, we have searched for a way home. Lost and alone in the dangerous labyrinth of fantastical worlds. What? Welcome to the lands of fame. It looks like an arcane game. Bioshock 4? Kind of looks Every like one. Is a chance for salvation. Kinda. Uniting the lost survivors. I mean, uh, uh. Oh, it's a massive multiplayer. Oh god, it's a survival game. Or leading us deeper. I am going to sleep. Good night. Made by Forest Devs? Isn't Forest really good? I played it when it was first, like, you know, developing and stuff. <laughs> this fucking guy? Nightingale. Fuck your stronghold. Our of hope. But beyond our reach. No, this actually does look as pretty long cool. As we stand together. I'll give it up. I'll give it Our up. Our journey will unite us. What? <laughs> what are these clothes? <laughs> you, the realm walkers. LARPers unite. Are all that is left. All right. Looks pretty good. Looks pretty good. I'll give it up. Not bad. I mean, the, the game itself isn't for me, but if it is for you, I could see that being pretty good. 
If it's a Love bounty game, I'll try. IP. And joining me now is Aaron sure. Flynn from Inflection Games. Aaron, you were on stage at the first Game Awards in 2014, accepting Game of the Year for Dragon Age, and now you've got a new studio, oh. Inflection, up in Canada. Um, what kind of game do we get here with uh, Nightingale? Oh, well, thanks, Jeff. Yeah, so it's a survival crafting game, uh, shared world idea, so we want to bring players together, solo experiences, cooperative well experiences, uh, lots of ability to go and explore these amazing, fantastical, magical realms we're going to give players. Lots of ability to come together, cooperate. What is it called? Infliction? Uh, lots of opportunity for community games? building, that sort of thing. Inflection? Well, it looks incredible. I said, I love, uh, show me this game a while ago. I was like, this looks so cool. We have to show this to uh, people. And it, you're pretty far along. That's real gameplay Inflection. footage. Inflection. So people play it Not next inflation. Year. Yeah, absolutely, yeah. So we're going to be in early access next year on PC only. And uh, looking forward to inviting players in. If you want to see more, playnightingale.com. Amazing. All right. Well, thank you for that announcement. A nice surprise for the Game Awards. And tonight, we've got much more coming up, but we're also going to introduce you to our Game Awards second annual Future Class, a group of 50 individuals who represent the bright, bold, and inclusive future of our industry. Can you can see the full that. list at thegameawards.com tonight. We're also partnering with Google Play to have our Future Class mentor the next generation of women in gaming. Google Play's Change the Game aims to improve female representation in gaming. For the next 12 months, a selected group of teenagers will receive hands-on guidance Bro, Jeff from last is year's spinning. Future Class as mentors. Right now, Jeff meet is talking one of the so new fast. members of our Future Class. Holy fuck. Jeff just had the oh, rap god then. I'm DJ Knight, and I stream on Twitch. Oh, they gotta hate me right now. Guys, don't it. jump stream. Focus Stay here. Don't go joy. watch him. Don't leave. Everybody has the potential to be cynical about everything. Oh, true! I hate it, but I hate everything it ever. It's easy to do that. It's much more enjoyable true. to find the good. A well, not always. Finding out that people shot rockets at your plane, it's a reminder that nothing is Being promised. cynical is fun. Do you want to look back on your life into negativity or focus on the good? It's easy to criticize Hello, and I'm fun. I'm Aaron Slobeck from Beat Games, and I'm thrilled to announce our new music pack collaboration. Lady Gaga music pack launches on Beat Saber tonight. See you all in He's kind of calling you out. Don't leave. Don't leave me. Come on. For the sake of the VOD. Oh, I was too late. <laughs> I gotta have this ready in the future. Don't let him see us, precious. Bro, I don't want to play as Gollum. I don't want to play as Gollum. Stop. I do? Why? He's ugly. Oh, look at him. Nothing filthy oxes. Kill them. No, we must hide. We can't let them. Tony is an elf main? I don't know what that means. I've never watched the movies. Holy shit, die. Die. Man. Alright, maybe I do want to play as Gollum. <laughs> Hi, Game Awards. It's Ms. Tech. Final Fantasy Hi, Ms. Tech. just released its latest expansion, Endwalker. And to celebrate, they're partnering with Grubhub on something really cool. Oh, Check out yeah? this piece I did with them and enjoy the rest of your show. Okay. All right, everyone, let's focus up. It's time to raid. Did they have to do that intro? All right, this is the top part. Get ready to stack. Yes, we got it. Woo, pizza party. Seriously, where did you get the pizza? Now when you order Where did you get the pizza? Code Endwalker, you get free delivery and unlock an exclusive pizza emote in Final Fantasy An exclusive so pizza beautiful. emote? I'm crying on my pepperoni. We've all been there. For now I want pizza. I'm hungry. <laughs> oh man. I was sitting sun, but I'll never run. Do people still play Do this game? I'm a dead man. Damn, I guess so. Holy shit. the original oh maybe it's the culling it's the culling let's go it's the culling the culling three
copium. Shut up. I love the culling, bro. China and India are keeping them alive. I knew it was big in China, but India? Good lord. <laughs> What's up, everybody? I am Ariel Powers. I'll be presenting the best moment. Bro, kick her out! Kick her out of the venue! <laughs> she never paid for a pass! Channel. I'll see you soon. She just keeps going to different places in the venue and telling people about her show. But she Back never actually puts on the show. I visited this, She's uh, hacking the stream. At his studio in the United Kingdom. He told me his dream was to one day share his game with the world at the Game Awards. Well, that dream is about to come true. <gasps> Enjoy. Oh, it better not suck. Bro, if your dream is to show the game and I hate it, that's so embarrassing for you. I better like this. I better like this. Okay. Is that a space game? So many space games, bro. How about a game about Earth? Finally. What? There's so much horror? I mean, I like horror, so that's fine. This is the second or third game I've seen tonight of, like, vaguely alien-looking technology shooting lasers at people. Earth is underrepresented. <laughs> this isn't new. I feel like I've seen it, right? Haven't we seen that? I don't know. I cannot wait to play Somerville thanks to Chris Olsen and the team at Jump Ship for that one. Next, we're going to head to the stage for a very special performance from a much-loved game studio. <gasps> Is it Cuphead? Is that Cuphead? I don't think it's Cuphead. Right? Ah! It's Cuphead! Yes! Oh my god! Yes! Please! Holy shit! Out now. Out now. I fucking love Cuphead, bro. Oh my god, it's real. It's real. They're gonna announce a delay till 2025 in song. Come on. It's a delicious last course of the delicious last course. Come on, it's right now. Right now. Bro, if it's if it comes out tonight, I'm beating it tonight. I gotta let you guys know. I fucking loved Cuphead. A lot of you weren't around for this. I played so much fucking Cuphead. I loved that fucking game. I beat it in two days. No, so in the 48 hours after it came out, I played for 35 of them. And I think I was the first person to S rank every stage. I was the first person to do it publicly. I played it so much. Dude, I streamed all of it. Because the S rank, you can't take a single hit. It took a long time. Yeah, it was bad. It was bad. I loved that game, dude. It was so fun. Come on. Out now. Out now. I know it's not out now, but say it is. I feel like such a YouTuber. I'm actually pogging. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. When? When? That's it? <laughs> what if that was it? <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Come on, come on, come on. Please, 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 please. It's so fucking cool, dude. 
Oh. Well, well, looks like it's Bon Voyage. Puppets! Old freaky puppets! This game is made for me. This time to the fabled DLC Island. What challenges await in this enchanted land? What better way to explore the island than with a leisurely climb into the mountains? Just Holy remember shit, to dude. Watch this game is made for me. I fucking love this. Was that three player? Don't forget to pack your mittens. I'm such a boomer. This was my childhood back in 1893. Please don't spoil all the bosses. Please don't. Oh, that's so fucking cool. He's definitely the end boss, by the way. He's the end boss, for sure. He's gonna be bad. For sure. Come on, come on, soon, soon, please, please, not June. I can't believe this. I can't believe that. They heard me. If I didn't say anything, it would have been June tonight. 30th, if I didn't say a so word, it would have been tonight, and I had to say uh, June. All right. Next up, earlier you saw the trailer it's for the last Sonic day of 2, June. the movie, and now it's time for the little blue guy to give you a glimpse at his next game, also coming in 2022. Okay, whatever. It's coming out. It's real. It's real. It's coming out, and it definitely won't get delayed until December. Don't worry, guys. This will be good. Copian. For sure. Oh, he's Senua. <laughs> he hears voices now. This is Metal Gear music. Open World Sonic? No. No fucking way. This is a Breath of the Wild mod. What? What? What are you talking about? An open world Sonic game? How do you even do that? It has to be so big. <laughs> what? It just looked like Breath of the Wild. <laughs> what? What are you doing? Okay. Cool. <laughs> I guess. Hey. TGA no mina san, konnichiwa. Kojima Hideo desu. Hey. Koto shi mo desu ne, TGA ni sanka deki nakute go. That's okay. I get it. I get it. Lai nen wa. Definitely. Copium. Shusseki sashi te itadakimasu. Boku no senyu de arimasu. Gireru mo Deltoro kantoku no sai shinsaku. Nightmare Array o go shouka shimasu. Douzo. Okay. I got a little job for you. It's just Oh, it's temporary. a movie. The folks here, they don't make no never mind who you are. Oh my God, why is he done. showing me a movie? Everything's got to be new these days. Breath of Sensation. the Wild Zelda. Breath yeah. of the Wild Pokemon and now Breath Let of the, the Wild Sonic. Breath of the Wild is now complete. Hell yeah. What's your pitch, pal? You want to love him? I'd love to learn anything that you want to teach me. I can read a Oh my God, player. Tony Collette. I know what they want. Folks will pay good money just to make themselves feel better. Oh, I'm gonna watch this. This looks like a good movie. When a man believes his own lies. I like this kind of shit. And people get By the way, the background said sus. I don't know if any of you guys you saw it. Lie. It said Jesus, but with the sus. You try to Please find tell me when you saw it. I warn you, didn't I? There is no way out. I'll watch it. I'll give it up. Wait, it comes out soon? Yeah. I never know when movies come out. That was the best I've seen since that Stranding. Now, on to award business. I am come out. honored to be announcing the best art direction category. These nominees across a broad variety of budgets and genres 
each found their own path to combining visual it's competing design, with Spider -Man? music, and animation <laughs> into their own distinct <laughs> expression of intent and purpose. Uh, you know, one franchise. I, I wish love the at least and one and of these presenters film. would be like, and now I, I would like to formally ask that everybody in the chat Anyhow, on Twitch the use the Prime art Gaming direction. sub on whatever streamer you're watching right now. Best art direction. I would love Guillermo del, del Toro after that. If he could just do that for me, I would appreciate that so much. Art direction is Psychonauts. If it's not Psychonauts, it's that we literally have a problem. Thank you, Frank fan. No, it's Psychonauts. If it's not Psychonauts, we have a we have a serious issue. Like Psychonauts is so much better than any of this. Maybe Art Boy State is good. I didn't play it. It has to be Psychonauts. And the game award. It for has best to be Psychonauts. There's no way to? it's not. I'm gonna harass him if it's not. Death Loop. Because last night I made the bet that Guillermo del Toro will be giving this award, so uh, this is awkward. <laughs> I'm I will speak to my, to my speech. So thank you, Guillermo, wherever you are. Deathloop um, had very good art direction, award. but it's also just the same fucking arcane art direction. I was direction. studying the 60s era by watching his movie, uh, it's, The Shape it's, of Water. It's that, but 60s. Um, it's good. Scrutinizing the sets, the colors, Deathloop the has great art. So Don't get me wrong, but like, Psychonauts was so also, fucking good. Also, thank you for rewarding or risk talking or patient for visual um, expression. It's probably because it didn't win Game of the Year. You think they did that? I attention to details. That, I don't uh, know, dude. Our players seem to really appreciate You need to it? realize nobody knows about Psychonauts anymore. Tonight, These proud, aren't decided by the public. The, the public the public have the a sway in it, but there's a they, there's an advisory board. Thanks to them for this I think that's how adventure. this works. Thanks to my long time art buddies. Because they also don't care about Deathloop. Dinga I don't think. Well, thanks I'm pretty you, sure bro. it's a board of people. We did it. Uh, thanks to the great people at Bethesda. Guillermo Sony, gave you a word to whoever would thank him most. A big hug for our families and friends. The French and lastly, are a very like thankful people. This award to the boss, Robert Altman. Why Please, would the board pick Psychonauts? Because it was fries. the best yes, one. I lost a bet last night also. Oh. That's insane, dude. That's insane. Death, listen, don't get me wrong. Deathloop had very good art. And it had very good direction. Congratulations to all the winners like, so far. And right now, we are Psychonauts excited to announce additional level, winners tonight. In the 100% fan voted Shut up. player's voice category, here are Come the on. final five nominees, as voted on by fans. And the Is game award Evil? goes to or Halo Infinite. Halo Infinite. Yeah. How is Halo up there? I guess it, RPG. Okay, okay. The nominees are. Don't care. Literally don't care. And the game award goes Literally. to. Tales of Arise. Tales of Arise. Two for two, baby. Two for two. Lock it in. For don't best care. Best score and music. Those uh, nominees are. Near? And the game award goes Near. to. Near. Near Replica. Boom. Three for three. Three for three. Next up is content creator of the year. I'm nice, First, bro. Let's hear from fans I'm and nice. creators themselves on who they I want know what's to win. up. We're creator of the year. I want Bro. Dream to win. Good luck, Dream. It's all about the beard, people. You gotta vote for Ebi. Hi, my name Apparently, is Ebi I is like an excellent for streamer. Of the year. I don't know him, but I've heard he's great. Well, let's see who was right. Here are the nominees for content creator of the year. I don't know anything about him, but... And the game award goes to... But I don't know anybody. Dream! Congratulations, Dream. Of course okay. not here in person. Here are the nominees for best multiplayer game. And the game award goes to... I don't know. It Takes Two! Oh, cool. Okay. Joseph, right. you did it! Knockout City is the best gameplay. I learned to keep microphones away from him. <laughs> Congrats. True, Not true. Had the best mobile game. Do you Please think Dream WNBA cheated? player and Team Liquid streamer, Ariel okay. Powers. Okay. Oh, it's her. She got... <laughs> How did she get here? She found her way on the mic. Thanks, Jeff. Here are the nominees for best mobile game presented by Verizon. How is she doing this? And the game award How is she goes doing to this? Genshin Impact. Stay right here. <laughs> We've got more game awards coming up after this. Oh, no. 
Oh no! What's good, Chicago? What the deal? Dude, there was all that Rams build up. Right. There was all that build up. She had like five spots before the show. Hey guys, I'm gonna be here at this time. Come watch me. Oh no! No! Within the world. When you oh, see that poor that lady. You know, you just impact. Don't know what to do? You feel confused. Oh. You feel upset. You feel hurt. I do feel like upset and hurt. I, can do I do. And put out into the world is a show. Oh, I know no. that things right now are very, very difficult. I know that things are all over the place in lots of different ways. It's scary, man. man. I mean, it's that's just there's no other way She's to put it. You're just scary <laughs> to be black in this. Country. She is definitely about to get harassed on the internet. That's true. She needs to call up Jeff right now. She needs Jeff's help expeditiously. She needs help this instant. I don't want to oh, bring no. politics. Well, I'm that glad poor woman. More this shit because it's quote unquote politics when this is a lot of people. <laughs> so the show goes up, it launches. <laughs> so I would see all these tweets. Oh, hey, you need to funny. listen to this. Hey, you need to check this out. Hey, oh, you need to be paying dude. attention to this. And then one of the big outlets. Called. Man. And then it just moves. Let's just speak the one. Genshin Impact. You know, I've oh, always wanted no. to use my voice in a way that felt powerful. Really she was telling me to watch her all this time. Doing a show through a prism of blackness. I think we did the job in a really good way. And I think the world and the industry was better for it. Dude. That's insane. Whoa! Two mobile ads? Two of them? If they let her in earlier, they could have told her how to pronounce it. Yeah, this is really on the admin side. Tony needs a lesson in blackness. Okay, brother. Relax. <laughs> Bro, this is like the third mobile ad tonight. Is React War Sunday or not? Yes. React War is on Sunday. Bring your funny movies. If Tim Schafer doesn't win anything this awards is a travesty. Do just uh, wants to make his goofy ass characters and fun games. I've kind of Wait, are these guys in PUBG? League is in PUBG? Wait. I didn't know that. Weird. Why would they pick PUBG? I guess they don't want to do Fortnite. With Amazon Luna, I can play all my favorite games straight know. from the cloud. Dude, That's I was right. worried about Psychonauts 2 because Tim Schafer has been kind of weird champ lately. Yo, and by lately, I mean over the past Which 10 one? years the because awesome. it's been that long. Like a dragon. Oh, they did Still Fortnite 2? Oh, shit. Okay. Judgment. Damn. Ripple Sticks Extraction. I can play That's any crazy. game without waiting for long downloads. There are so many great games. Luna Couch, anyone? Name one. I'm in. Feels like I'm on your couch. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Wait, do you hear that? I heard number one trending? I think they had a mic left on. Yeah. Blessed Sigma, the world drowns in corruption. Blessed Your Sigma. Your empire is aflame with heresy. The faithful perish, and the wicked multiply. Mm. I'm a blessed Sigma. Blessed Sigma, lend me your strength. Grant me the will to purge the corrupt, what to smite this? the heretic, to bring hope when hope Did anything is lost. cool get announced? Not yet, I don't think. Did anything cool get announced? By the comet and the hammer, I play Persona? The Shut up. Battles. Open world. So oh, Cuphead. Yeah, but I that's not even. We knew that was coming. And never retreat. Song of Nunu? <laughs> Against the flames of perdition to drive back the shadow of chaos with your holy light. <laughs> Finish freeing, have you? Where is your patience, Master Dwarf? Have I ever let you down? Victory favors the faithful. Let us teach them fear. So what is this Vermintide? For Sigma and the Empire! 
Warrior Priest. Okay. I heard Vermintide is great. I've never played it because I don't care about uh, Warhammer, but... Oh, available now! Neat. Don't leave, though. Don't leave. It's a bad She's left for deck. She's an actor who stars Damn. in The Mandalorian and the upcoming series, The Book of Boba Fett. Please <laughs> welcome Ming-Na Wen. Boba Fett has a book? Book of who? <laughs> a gaming narrative is more than a collection of cutscenes. It represents our own involvement with the story and its characters. To be nominated for the best narrative award, a great game Dude, demands none of these games have really good dialogue stories. and a captivating plot. But above all, it must exhibit a meaningful involvement. I don't think any audience. of these have really good stories. And also, just speaking as the mother of a son who loves gaming. Psychonauts does? Not it's really. Nice when I mean, it's nice more to the story I liked than it, just but blowing up it's not amazing. grenade factories and shouting obscenities at your alligator brides. Here are the She's nominees for best narrative. Her best son is narrative. a gamer. Every loop I'm learning a little more. I mean, Deathloop. Together the puzzle. I don't know. Deathloop is just time it was travel a spell, stuff. I am telling you. If it is a spell, how do we break it? I need to find out exactly Oh God! What Life is strange I, is gonna win, isn't it? Their secrets. Oh God! You have proven yourselves unworthy, and you must be destroyed. Oh. My name is Raz, and today is my first day on the job. None of these games have really great narratives. Guardians was really good, was it? And the game award for best narrative goes Death to... Deathloop, I guess. Probably Deathloop. <laughs> Marvel's Guardians of the Galaxy. Okay, I didn't play it. Can you guys tell me if it deserved it? Are they Kate posting? It's good, is it? Seriously, I'm being genuine. Is it good? I just... I can't get it. I can't get hype for Marvel. This song with nobody clapping. It's great as a fan of the comics. Okay. Okay, that was a surprise. Uh, <laughs> there are so many people responsible for making I, this I just don't, such a wonderful thing. I, I want to thank Marvel Game Studios for trusting I don't us like Marvel. with their characters and uh, for allowing us to make them our own. Does he have an Iron Maiden shirt? Cast, he does. For bringing them to life I, I'm, in ways I'm not that a Marvel guy. Never do. I was not for interested. Olivier, I feel like Marvel stories Hubert, all Bea, blend together for me. Director, I just the can't get into it. entire crew so. who worked on it. And of course, my good for them, wild, I guess. wacky, immensely talented writers. Thank you for making comedy look easy. Thank you for not complaining too often when I pushed you to remember our main themes of grief and to go deeper. <sighs> Who am I kidding? I know you complained, but thank you thank for you, not Frostmort. doing it to me. <laughs> thank you, everyone. This is I will honor. say, this is going to sound weird and maybe a little entitled, and I don't mean it to be. Seriously, I don't. I was hoping Cuphead was taking so long because they decided instead of doing DLC, they would just do Cuphead 2. And I understand why they don't because it takes forever, but I was kind of hoping that deep in my heart, but... It's okay. I'll like it no matter what. Animation takes time. Well, you're just drawing, bro. Like... You're just drawing. Draw faster. What are you talking about? Okay, now, you're gonna tell me this is not Breath of the Wild, bro? You're not gonna tell me this is Breath of the Wild? She held the lantern like this. She held the lantern like this. That's not Breath of the Wild? Huh? That should kind of look like Breath of the Wild. Wait. <laughs> that should look like Breath of the Wild. <laughs> I don't know why I like that so much. This got announced before, right? Oh my god, it has <laughs> That's literally everything. Oh shit, it's prop hunt. It's prop hunt. Looks closer to Wind Waker. 
I mean, the style is Wind Waker, but the gameplay is Breath of the Wild, right? Yeah, I remember this. You could possess shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tasha. Oh, that's cute. What a beautiful game. All right, now we have something very special. The gameplay world premiere trailer for Rocksteady's newest title, Suicide Squad, Kill the Justice League. We've been <laughs> waiting anxiously for them to give us a first look at... Four-player co-op shooter, bro. Four-player co-op shooter. Kaylee! What the hell do you think you're doing? Huh? Is that Deborah Morgan? That footage is strict. Let's go! I love her! I think that's no. Deborah Morgan is from Dexter. Wait, who the fuck am I thinking of? Deborah. I don't remember. <laughs> Deborah Wilson. Let's go. <laughs> I love Deborah and since Wilson. The Game Awards doesn't care. She's the best. About disclosing classified intel. Listen up. Whatever you've heard about Task Force X, the state of the Justice League, or Superman. Rampaging through the streets of Metropolis, you better not say a word ever to anyone. Because if you do, believe you me, I'll hear about it. You've all been warned. Roll her out. So I think that was a. Uh, I think that was like a. Okay, that's a meta thing, I think. She gone? Good. All right. Well, I think we've waited long enough to see Rock City's new game. This is going to be worth the risk. You want you guys want to do it? Because because they were saying for years that Rock City was working on a Superman game, like forever. Justice League. I think of Wonder Woman, Superman, Green Lantern. You don't want to mess with that lot. But you, Barry, you're just the team mascot, aren't you, mate? The loser of the league, folks. The fastest man alive. It's who is the this? Fucker. I don't even know who that is. Flash is alive, and he's playing for Team Brainiac. I gave you orders. Kill the Flash. Or I'll kill you, my Digger. <laughs> Captain Boomerang. <laughs> what the fuck? Can stop me. Uh. Wait, he moves fast too? Captain Boomerang is the Flash? Really? Why don't you just mail me the bullet? I'm the eye in the sky. The Avengers game reskin? See, that's what I was thinking, because it kind of looks like shit. But it's Rocksteady. Rocksteady makes good games. So... I'm... Optimistic, but... They used to make good games, well... I trust Rocksteady, but this... It's kind of generic. But I guess it's just generic fighting, right? Okay, I don't like that. Okay, this looks pretty cool. All right. Kind of like Crackdown. No escape from my wrath. I'll give it up for that. Movement looks fun. Yeah. This is cool. It flashes like the first boss. He Hadoukens? <laughs> really thought Flasher had us that Stop, stop, stop. That's the fourth time. Stop, please. Stop, please. Please stop the sound. From the upcoming game Forspoken, here are the performers Ella Belinska and Pollyanna McIntosh. All right, I, I trust Rocksteady. It did look pretty cool. I will say that. It did look Hi, pretty cool. I'm so but. excited to be here with it. Guys, check it out. The <laughs> subs, by the way, 1776. Good year. 
Frey but Holland. you know, I am so think we could bump it up a little bit. How about another great year and in our nation's history? Maybe 1812? Huh? Anybody? Huh? Anybody? Huh? She mm -hmm. is a ruthless Anybody? adversary for Frey, and I hope players get into it. Looking for a boss fight with this woman at some point. I definitely. I don't know what happened. I just fight. know there was a fight. Cute Ella, that's so kind. When was Even the pig was pig war? If, if, if it's Bay of Frey. Pigs? <laughs> that was like in the eighties. You want to bump it up and now there? A world premiere trailer for Forspoken. In 1812, they burned down the White House. Who did that? I didn't know that. Canadians? Wait. Wait, wait. We were at war with Canadians in 1812? Why? What's their problem? I didn't know this. I mean, it's not a bit. I didn't know this. I'm learning so much. They were a British colony, not Canada. Okay, never mind. Canada wasn't real back then. Thank you for 1777. An even better year. Thank God. How do you plead? Not guilty. Lies. She dies. <laughs> <laughs> I like that character. I like that character. That's a funny guy. <laughs> That's a funny character. <laughs> That's a funny judge. A joking judge. Content court. <laughs> I'll give it up for that guy. Big fan. Bro, what's our problem? You literally live in America. How are you watching my stream from Canada? Are you on a VPN? You trying to evade your oppressive government? I'm gonna report you. Strictly to your boy Justin. That's his name, right? What is this? Company, come on. This is We've lost the square. Wait, is this Starship Troopers? Oh, it's Warhammer. Oh, I didn't. Wasn't. I thought I, th I saw I saw bug enemies. I thought it was Starship. I got excited for a second. I didn't know it was gonna be this. Yeah, but Justin's hot. Joe Biden was attractive when he was like 40 years younger. You're just mad because your president isn't 82 years old. <laughs> Cringe. Imagine not having an old, wise president as your leader. The wisest man in the country. <laughs> Imagine not electing a, w <laughs> a wise elder statesman to the highest authority in the land. That's so embarrassing for you. <laughs> He's so wise. We picked the oldest guy. No, we picked the wisest guy. He's very wise. <laughs> I don't know why this is so funny to me. <laughs> Calling the president wise. <laughs> Bro, this is like the fourth Warhammer game. I'm not buying your game. I'm not doing it. I'm sure they're fun. People like them. Maybe you get to color his suit. Like, you get to paint your little toys. You get to go to the store at the mall and pick out little gray toys, and you get to paint them with a little Joining brush. now is Tim Willits from Saber and the star of the game who will... Bro, take that weapon away. Who let him in here uh, with that? Tim, uh, what did we just see? How'd he get well, that uh, past the metal see, detector? Talk about this game. You know, we are You're in grave danger. A sequel to the iconic, you know, Warhammer 40K game. 
you know, and at Saber, um, threat you know, detected. We've, uh, we're using the experience that we have we have learned from games like Halo. Watch out Champions, for Clive Standen. Uh, World War Z. When he's really standing next to you. To, life, to make it the most intense. <laughs> and we've got Clive as a space marine. It's awesome. Clive, how does it feel to be in the game? Oh, it's a dream. I can't tell if that's a big guy or the other guy's a little guy. Anyone's ever seen any of the work I've done? I'm not scared of the. What was that? That's the sound of the chainsaw. I'm stoked and grateful to be a part of this. He's gonna let it rip. Play with and paint the Space Marines when I was a kid. Jeff is a medium guy. Oh, he painted. He painted his little boys. Omega laugh like Geppetto in his workshop. Everything to me. So it fits you. Looks looks good. So Jeff is a medium sized guy. And awesome for you guys to show the gameplay. Tim, Clive, thank you so much for joining us. And right now. Here's a brand new look at Saints Row. <laughs> I did not expect him to say that. It was not the game I thought he was going to. <laughs> that was such a weird pivot. <laughs> okay, well. I want to see how this one goes. The early Saints Row games were basically just GTA copies. And then when GTA got more serious with GTA 4, Saints Row went the other way and they went super goofy and ridiculous. And it was very fun. But then they sort of, I don't know, it looked like they were going to go back. But no, this is looking very goofy and arcadey, which is perfect. That's what they need. I think 3 and 4 came out right at the time for goofy internet humor. Yeah, 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 yeah I think you're right. It went kind of Borderlands. <laughs> But they need to dial back on it. And it looks like that's what this is, which is Saints Row 4 tried too hard. I don't think so. I think it, it came out at the time right before that was, like, really try hard funny. Because it was a very funny game. I do remember that game being funny. They have to go full Leslie Nielsen as if all this is normal and serious. That's a good point, yeah. It can't wink at the camera. There was a mission in Saints Row 3 or 4, which was really funny. It was a co-op mission, and you had a live tiger in your back seat. And one person had to drive the car, while the other one played a rhythm minigame and had to pet the tiger to keep it from biting you, which was very funny. Huh? <laughs> Why? Why? What are you, how did you get this? Go how did you do this? How did they do this? How did you land this? How did they do that? They got fucking more Disney? I know they got Jungle Book, but bro, Fall Guys marketing team goes crazy. I don't know who's on their sales team, but they are killing it. What a cool game, bro. I love Fall Guys. I love Fall Guys as an idea. I wish I could... I wish it wasn't Stream Poison. <laughs> we talked before about Stream Poison. I used to want to have every item that ever came out There's in Fall Guys. There's still plenty of show left. And why would you want to watch alone when you could watch with me and Ariel Powers? Exactly. Tune oh into our watch party God. to see a lot of exclusive interviews. Again? And Trust me, you do not want to miss it. Uh, but don't take our word for it. Come to twitch.tv again. Facebook, powered by Verizon 5G. Come check it out. They're just outside. Oh my god, dude. Dude, I heard this game bombed. I don't know if it's true, but I heard that game did very badly on release. Joy to your world. The time has come to dominate. Why is she saying it like a question? Oh, it's EA. That's very EA. That's very EA. Have a gamer Christmas. Hey guys.
guy's phase rug here. Yo, another influencer. Yo, we're gonna, we're gonna we're gonna kill a thousand million mech 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 for charity, bro. Check it out. Wait, I think I had a sponsor ask me if I would play this game. No, TK did this. Now I remember. I didn't get asked. See you in the arena. Mech arena. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, mech arena. If you need another streamer, I'm your guy. I'm right here. Okay. Go ahead and shoot me an email. Coney.panda. Uh, Coney at panda.gg. Give me a ring. Don't turn down sponsors. I, I've, I turn them down sometimes. I had a sponsor from a... Uh, what was it? I had a sponsor from a company that specialized in Japanese snack products. And I'm well, like... The gold medal. Was that... No. <laughs> what? <laughs> Is one title enough? I always take raid, bro. No. Raid Shadow Legends. What every time I get that offer, I'm taking it. I'm letting you know. No way. Why you of all people? I don't know. With every I got a sponsorship, uh, uh, or not a sponsorship, but I got uh, an email for a company that makes like plushes for creators. So the idea is they could make me like a plushie. But I was Welcome like, I don't have an idea for the plushies, award. so it's no. The man you just saw in that also, WD the splits black weren't good. And you so, off WD U2s? No, it's not U2s. Uh, to celebrate the Game Awards. Please welcome seven-time NBA All-Star and owner of Endemic, Paul George. Rant Sona plushie? <laughs> All right, well, hold up. That might be good. Paul George? I don't know who this is. Can anybody tell me who this is? Good evening, is? everyone. Um, I love action adventure games for their versatility. One minute Name you're one. solving a puzzle, the next you're lining up headshots, and then suddenly you're being put on a hook by a vampire lady taller than me. <laughs> this category is like a showcase of what it means to be a video game. Here are the nominees for best action adventure game. Best action adventure See, game. this category pisses me off because it's literally just all the games of the year. It's the same thing. Which means whoever wins this probably is not winning game of the year. I'm gonna go and say Dread wins this. Dread wins this, RE8 wins game of the year. Lock it in. Yeah, this is the runner-up shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dread wins this. RE8 and wins game of the year. Game award for best action adventure game goes If it's Psychonauts, I'm going to be so sad, dude. Metroid Dread. Yeah. Dread wins this, but it will not win game of the year. I want Psychonauts to win game of the year, but it's definitely going to be Resident Evil. Bro, is that my boy Doug? Dougie B? On behalf of the teams at Nintendo and Mercury Steam who worked on Metroid Dread, thank you so much for this award and congratulations to all the other nominees. This is the action adventure category and Metroid Dread checks off both the action and the adventure box. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's filled with action packed moments behind Is he every running a bounty? Around every corner. You already and won. Level. And at the same time, it introduces us to a massive and mysterious new planet what that the players can explore and adventure through. Does he think this is a direct? It's the result of a true collaboration between Nintendo and Mercury Steam. Rifle host. I have host. a few comments that the developers asked me to read on their behalf. <laughs> We'd like to say a big thank you for this award from the development teams at Nintendo Holy and shit. Mercury Steam that worked so hard to bring all the Metroid <laughs> fans around the world the experience that they were hoping for. That's so funny. It's been a dream come true to travel together and this dangerous yet marvelous He just reads off the ZDR. plot synopsis We're for so Metroid for Dread on Wikipedia. For enjoying Metroid Dread on While Nintendo you explore Switch. a dangerous planet, much. a dangerous robot known as the Emmy tracks your movement. <laughs> What's so funny is when you watch the Nintendo presenters or, you know, the people who accept the award, they're always way more polished than any other, like, of the developers. But I guess it's because he's not the we developer, right? He's that's a dumb history. thing to say. Never mind. And the but they always for Nintendo, they always send up really like polished like we rule content people. You know what I mean? People who Here, present. We must scrabble for desert power. Yeah, Nintendo's very polished. When the day of your revenge will come. This is your inheritance. Speed is They're also like Nintendo rich. Thus, 
There will always be a you desert on Arrakis. What is to become of the Baron Vladimir Harkonnen? Oh, it is Doom. Or Beetlejuice. Beetlejuice had sandworms. Yet you rolled with him. Does the Gwee Fremen have a saying? God created Arrakis to train the people. Arrakis. To hold Arrakis. Is Doom in somebody's hand? Oh, maybe it's mobile. This is my honor. This is my vengeance. This is my doom. Four oh. X real time strategy game. I don't know what four X means. I see that sometimes. Please welcome two of the stars of the upcoming Tiny Tina's Wonderland. Like Civ? Ashley yeah, but what's four X? Will Arnett. I get. I know it's like Civ. But... Bro, Will Arnett is in everything now. Oh, not tiny teeth. All right, I'm gonna go get food. I'll be right back. Oh, what's up, I have baby to see girls? if they reuse Thank the you jokes for again. Having us. We are so excited to reveal she a bit about is the so story little. in Tiny Tina's Wonderlands. Yeah. I are, think Will Arnett is actually pretty Lord tall, yet? though. Yes, Will plays the Dragon Lord, the central villain within the Wonderlands. Yes, but in a clever twist, I turn out to be the underdog hero of the entire realm, and it's really beautiful. And it's actually one of the main reasons that I took this role, so. Mm, no. What do, you, what do you mean, no? You play a necromantic overlord, and not the good kind. Well, he's a job creator for millions of unemployed individuals. I he love Will Arnett. Dead, man. Yeah, I think he's he doing his best. Stuff to do. But okay. after watching Some Bojack and then seeing him on a Some Lego kid show band. and then listening to him show Reese's. Like, I don't know, stab and, things I always say Reese's, but it's Reese's. Do and then I see him, and the, I don't know what he like. The game that you're well, sure, no, yo, you mean the the whimsical? All I hear is Bojack. The yeah, I can't. Year old demolitions uh, expert, yeah, who whimsically tries to it's blow up the It's kind of in character for, for Bojack. Yeah, yeah, it is, so and that's the weird is the thing, right? Villain here, it's Tiny Tina. All right, roll the damn trailer. I think just Job. I was gonna say, I think some people just think of Arrested Development. There right? is a world beyond. At least he's the not pitched for true. A world forged by wonder and ruled by fate. There's one alone who can wield fate. One I don't know. Watching a show where Will Arnett hands. voices a character the who complains maker. about having to show for shit and like doesn't That's know who you. he is, Heavy and then red. watching Will Arnett show for shit, it just it it's it's different. You know what I mean? It's like I can't I can't take that. You it's it, I I can't I can't I compartmentalize you. it. You know. I'm sure he's fine, and I'm sure I it's not okay, Valentine, but I'm just like, gallant you know, it's called acting. I know, Fred. I know, it's just, I can't, I'm stupid, okay, I know. I'm cool, I don't care, I, I, you're right, you're right. A beautiful body indeed. I'm doing our rant so <laughs> No, if I was doing Rant Sona, I would say that Boj I would say that Will Arnett is committing a fallacy, and in this video, I will dissect his arguments and say why they're in bad faith. Whatever the fuck. I need to put my Rant Sona on the on the stream so I can pop it whenever I want. Let's say hypothetically. I would be tweeting at Will Arnett every day, demanding he respond to my 600 view video. You left a cheese curl on the board. Mayhaps it is a a powerful ancient meteor. I'm low key so sick of Borderlands. I don't know why. I know why. Borderlands has just done the same shtick since 2004. It just never really evolved. You know. Hold on. What game are we playing here? We're playing Bunkers and Badasses, baby. Bro, badass. Every time with the badass. Every time with the badass. Randy is killing me. Wait, is this Sleigh Bells? I just realized this is Sleigh Bells. I like Sleigh Bells. Yeah, I don't like, uh, I don't like Borderlands. I think all of you know that. Last I come to Borderlands for badass like I come to Cody for cynical awards, behavior. Now they're back in a totally new, a rebrand, unexpected bro. way.
I didn't hear what he said was back. So this will be new to me. Oh, this is VR. Right? <laughs> that sounds funny. That sounds very funny. That sounds very funny. Pretty fun. All right, tonight yeah, we have a very special K-pop so. performance. The South Korean developer Pearl Abyss wanted to thank you for the great response to their recent trailer for their upcoming open world action adventure game, Doke V. So they created a music video working with the popular K-pop dance team, One Million Dance Studio. Enjoy. I'm gonna get some food. How's it look? Is it cool? Is it cool, you guys? Is it cool? Oh, you want ads? Dude, I have a bounty. I should have popped it, but I didn't know how long this would be. I did have a bounty. All night, we are wrapping up 2021 with Spotify, and here for the first time are the top three male and female artists as listened to by you on gaming consoles in 2021. Top female artists. Doja Cat, Billie Eilish, and Ariana Grande. Top male, Juice World, XXX, Tanashian, and Polo G. Later, we will reveal the most listened to Spotify songs. Now, a winner earlier tonight for best mobile game. Here's a look at two new characters coming December 14th to Genshin Impact. That's tough. And the first glimpse of the upcoming character, Yeon Jin. Yeon Jin? From League of Legends? The sky is clear and the sun is shining. Time to get the Yoni Kabuto out for some training. Gen shit in pants. <laughs> to survive hardship, you must prepare for hardship. Keep your weapon at the ready. You never know what's around the corner. Just thought of that. I just thought of that. <laughs> Tony, you're 32. I'm 33. Fire hazard! Hold the line! Charge! Let's roll! Get shit Rally. in pants! It's showtime! <laughs> it's funny every time. I still don't believe you did this bounty. Bro, pay out. That's all I can say. I think this bounty and the No Man's Sky bounty were the fattest bounties I've ever had. They were insane.
How did you manage to do this for an hour? It's claim simulator. The game tells you to click here to claim, collect your prize, and then you just do that over and over for an hour. That's it. Thank you, Ruby Candies. The king has gone insane. He is a proponent of a theory called animal magnetism. <laughs> the the He's face. capable of anything. From the heavens to vanquish the clockwork time. Steel rising. Spiders made? Never mind. <laughs> What's up, everyone? This is Matt Hafey, lead guitar oh, player and lead Matt singer of the Hafey. metal band Trivium. I'm also a streamer on Twitch. I'm stoked to announce that I'm in Metal Hell Singer, a rhythm-based shooter game. Make sure you check it out. We also have incredible metal screamers, singers like myself, like Alyssa from Arch Enemy, Randy from Lamb of God. Check it out, my friends. I will see you all in hell. I'm not going to hell. I'm good. There was a soul. That. Had music inside. Why would I go to hell, bro? They I hit wall her. kicks every time. I'm God's favorite the streamer. Unknown. Oh, it's Doom, but. Oh, wait! That's kind of cool. BPM? Oh, <laughs> is that what BPM is? I was thinking of, like, Crypt of the Necro Dancer. So this is BPM. Kinda cool, I guess. Is this DMCA? You guys know what this song is about? <laughs> A little birdie told me what this song was about. <laughs> That's a fun meta joke. Is it about gaming? No. David Lee Roth would not be happy if he was alive to hear this song. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, a mobile game? That's kind of tight. That's kind of tight. Huh. That looks cool. I didn't know that existed, no. Welcome back, and that's right, starting in 2022, there's a new way to play your favorite mobile games on your PC through Google Play Games. Take games from your pocket to your desktop and seamlessly no. pick up where you left off Google Play Games on PC is coming soon in 2022. No. Next, here's another brand new game announcement for the first time at the Game Awards. Ellen Wake 2 again. I enlisted because I didn't want to wait years just to get out and see the galaxy. I wanted to go somewhere, see new worlds, look up at a sky no one's ever seen before. It's been a dream of mine since before I can remember. So I would be honored to become a captain someday. Oh my god. We need to learn everything we can. Good for them, I guess. We're not gonna die. Not if I have anything to say. Oh, gameplay. Gameplay. Oh. Right. Hold on. Time to impact one minute. It's not just dialogue. Zap the orbs. I need you to it's like Alan right Wake. Thing. You just pointed at the thing. There you go. Sick. Cool. The fate of the negotiations, the interests of the Federation, and the prospect for peace. Isn't he dead? May very well depend on it. By the way, space again. What's up with space, bro? What's going on with space? He's back again. Make 
some noise for Reggie. That's my fucking guy, baby. That's my boy. Big Reg in the building. Thank you. Surely thank you. Reggie will tell you guys to subscribe with Prime. Wow. He's going to look yeah, out for me. I said it earlier. Isn't it great to be back live and in person, back amongst friends? It's fantastic. What if he shills for Nintendo just a as a force of habit? Time of the year. The Game Awards. Our opportunity to celebrate the creators so weird and the players. What is this, Jeff? Eighth year? Something like that? Is it? So much. Yeah, you know, we've witnessed so much over How these past few years. The launch of next generation I eight feel like it's only and started nine since consoles. Like 2015. The mobile revolution. Wow. Streaming games. VR. AR. And quality free-to-play games. And this category represents another innovation in our industry. This is the award Damn, for year? best crazy. ongoing game. It used to be that a game would ship, and that would be the game. But today's developers keep players coming back to their beloved titles again and again by delivering and creating exciting new content. Here are the five <laughs> I, nominees I forgot how much for I love engaging their presenting. audiences year after He's year. so funny. Best ongoing game. It's either Fortnite or Final Fantasy. Because despite how much I don't care about it, I can't stop hearing about this fucking Final Fantasy game. Jesus Christ. He's gonna say it's Animal Crossing. And the winner is Animal Crossing New Horizons. Genshin. <laughs> and the game award for the best ongoing game goes to uh. Final Fantasy. Yeah. Yeah, of course. Of course, bro. What the fuck is happening in Fortnite, bro? Tonight, Fortnite Final is Fantasy crazy. 14 Online also wins best community support. I, I, I was staying at Alpharad's house a few months ago, uh, and I did not realize how many fucking people are in Fortnite now. You could run across any character from any media franchise. It's insane. Like, you, if you don't keep your eye on it all uh, the time, you will be shocked. To win best ongoing game. Truly. Uh, the category had so many amazing nominees that it's truly fortunate that we were able to win. Um, there's an incredible team behind Final Fantasy XIV. Fortnite is fun, I'll say it. Dude, uh, I feel like people hate on Fortnite too much. And Seriously. To our fans. Uh, I think the idea of Fortnite is very, Walker and, and, and beyond. very so, cool. A big thank you. You know, to like Final a constantly evolving, and, changing platform. Uh, can't wait to see what's going on in the future. I think that's really neat. Uh, and honestly, the biggest thanks to our community. It's the community. Uh, yeah, but like our rock, and we're so know. happy that you continue. I feel to like you can't judge games so based on their communities. You know, you sort uh, you can choose not to engage with it that way, but every community is cringe. Yeah, like I, I feel like every game has that. You know. Outer Worlds. Since the dawn of time, what? we have sought the glory of competition. But it wasn't always what you Wait, is this Knockout friendly. City? As civilization evolved, so did the desire for battle and the drive to be the best. Cities grew, and soon <laughs> everyone wanted a piece Fortnite of the Fortnite without spam building is a banger game. Some Wait, is it ready to rumble? Some bang. But many just Bro, ready to rumble, the please. The Even today. Oh, come on. It's knockout city. Uh -oh. but... It's knockout city, but wrestling? It's a it's a wrestling battle royale? <laughs> it's a pro wrestling battle royale. This game is going to be extremely fun and die in a week. I bet this game is going to be so fun. 
and it's going to just die immediately. What the fuck? <laughs> Die. What if she put up a wall? Like a Fortnite wall? Okay, so it's fine. All right. I mean, I'm playing it, bro. I'll play it. I bet it's fun. That was Rumbleverse coming next year from Iron Galaxy and sure. Epic Games. And tomorrow, sure. there's a first look gameplay event. Head to rumbleverse.com to oh, sign up. Oh, I'll check up. it out. Now, here's the world gameplay debut of a sequel to a Game Awards nominee from a few years ago, A Plague Tale Requiem. <laughs> A sleep tale, good night, lullaby, Quiam. Because I'm sleeping, champ. Under this is the, the rat game, right? And starry sky. <laughs> Alright, what else did Iron Galaxy make? Dig the grave. And Dive I kick? Lie. And killer instinct. Amicia, but come. only two and you three? Go. I'm right behind you. Glad did I live. You a fuck on the boards. And I laid me down with a will. All right. Impossible. This be the first. Wait, Dean Takahashi. Me. That's the Cuphead Come guy. On. You've seen worse than this. <laughs> Here he lies. Where he longed. The gameplay is on the site Home already. All right. Hold is on. the sailor. Home from sea. And the hunter. Uh, home. Gameplay. From the hill. Just think of it. So it's just slamming people. I don't know what's happening to me, Lucas. I feel my mind going. I know. Think <laughs> of your brother. The you slamming people on. looks very funny. Oh no. We'll watch what more. What have this you later. done? Whatever. Thank you, Jingo. Thank you very much. Fortnite without spam building is a banger game. Sorry, I'm just seeing that. Dude, I, 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 that's why I don't like Fortnite. This year, is the we partnered with Grubhub to, get into to do something it. really cool to it get is your kind food of delivered like for the Game Awards. Order Grubhub the using the code for that Endwalker game, right? during the show to get free delivery on all orders of $15 or more and an exclusive Final Whoa. Fantasy 14 Eat Pizza emote for the game. I know you get some dinner. That, we got lots lots of shows still to go. This year, Teclan celebrated its rifle. 30th anniversary, and next year, Dying Light 2 arrives after a long wait. We've got a new look right now at the game's story with this CG trailer. I'm trying to get a pizza emote, bro. The song I'm thinking of. I've heard this song in like four different game trailers now. Oh, it's Where Is My Mind? Oh, never mind. It is Where Is My Mind. You're right. No. I thought it was the one that was like, When you try so hard, but you don't succeed, could it be where? That one. Yellow? No. <laughs> that was when they were still good. That yellow is when Coldplay was still good. It's the bad Coldplay. Bro, early Coldplay is excellent. Early Coldplay, don't let people dissuade you. Wait for Parachutes me. is an incredible album. Jerry's parachutes is so good. Blush of blush of blood. Rush of blood to the head is pretty good, but not as good as parachutes. 
Early Coldplay was when they really wanted to be Radiohead. Well, I've never listened to Radiohead, so I don't know if that's true. <laughs> Parachutes was my first album. Thank you for finally validating my music choice. You know what my first album was? A Little Bit of Mambo by Lou Baker. <laughs> first album I ever bought with my own money. Not, and then he got horny for Mickey Mouse. Is that why you're a furry today? Shut up. People are going to believe you if you say shit like that. That's how rumors start. Okay? The Fifth Symphony by Beethoven. Okay, smartass. You, you're on thin ice. I have a pig rant soda. I haven't debuted that yet. I haven't been watching. Does this look cool? I mean, it looks kind of cool to me now, but I'm like halfway through. <laughs> A company called Global Risk? That company's name was Global Risk? How did they ever get investors? What the fuck? Crossfire. Okay. Let the Xbox fans have their game. The island you once knew has flipped. Whoa! Welcome to Chapter 3. Bro, they might say my name. new places to explore and exciting new ways to experience Fortnite. They might actually say my name before. on the Game Awards. Start by earning Battle Pass XP beyond Battle Royale. Yeah, but Royale. where? Where are you going? It's all about where playing do you your go? way to level up and unlock Battle Pass outfits. Where's your favorite including location? Including Spider-Man. Oh my god, it's Spider-Man. There's also new features to check out. Oh, it's Gears Get of War. Get around more quickly and invade enemy fire with new sliding and swinging. Everybody it can even set up camps where you and your squad can heal what and store fuck? items from match to match. Wait, from match to match? Plus, there are new weapons That's and crazy. items to help win a victory what? royale and earn the ultimate prestige, the victory crown. Keep winning and keep the crown. Along with these features, the island is all new. Explore Sanctuary, hidden home of the Seven, in Spider-Man's home turf, the Daily Bugle, Along with many more locations. Name one! And with the island's new weather conditions, anything can happen. He won't do it. In addition to all new gameplay, check out the Chapter 3 Season 1 Battle Pass that features Spider Man, the Falcon, that shit looks like the Battle Pass. More newcomers. So what are you waiting for? Drop into Chapter 3 and start exploring the new island, because you'll never know what you might find. Oh, I missed the rock. <laughs> I was Battle Pass posting. Oh, is this the, uh, I heard this game was pretty good. Right? I heard this is pretty nice. You get to be a vampire. Rumbleverse dev said you could sign up today and play tomorrow. Well, well, well. Good thing I signed up today. Might stream it tomorrow. Who knows? <laughs> Die, holy shit. The game is full of malware? Wait, this game? Really? Why? Or what? Splatoon, but vampires. That is very reductive, and I think you know that. You are being very cynical. Wait, that game's not already out? I thought it was. I thought there was a game on Steam that was like that. Whatever. 
It's been a great year so far for Shark Mob on their first game, Blood Hunt. They just completed a successful early access, and I'm very excited oh, for their full release next year. Blood Hunt will be I'm out sure. on PS5 yeah, and PC for sure, for sure. in definitely, spring definitely, 2022 sure. and will be free to play. Back when I started the Game Awards in 2014, this one. band made a bet on me in the show if you believe again. we could make the Game Awards a reality. Seven years That's later, funny. Imagine Dragons is back at the Game Awards for a once-in-a-lifetime performance that celebrates 10 years of super giant games and their first release, Bastion. What? Please welcome Imagine Dragons, featuring the composers and songwriters behind all of Super Giant's games, oh, Darren wait. Corb and Ashley Barrett. I was gonna mute music. Oh my God, that what is so great. Thank you to Imagine Dragons, JID, and they Ashley Barrett and Darren Corb. That's something you will only see at the Super Game Awards. Giant, Super Giant, Tonight we partnered with Chevrolet Super to make the Game Super Awards live stream more accessible, thing. including care. an audio descriptive stream, ASL stream with deaf gamers TV on Twitch, and closed captions. It's important. And now, to present the Innovation and Accessibility <laughs> really Award, games. please yeah. welcome Jack Septicai and a member of our future class from 2020 and one of the judges who helped select the nominees for accessibility. Stop in the morning, the incredible incredible ladies. Morgan Baker. Please do it. Please do it, Jack. I fucking love it when he does that. That's my favorite intro of any YouTuber ever. Jack Septicai annoys me. You're in the wrong chat. We love him here. Tonight. Games are for everyone. And this award recognizes the teams that are advancing gameplay, features, and technology. I don't watch sure his stuff, but he seems like a good and guy. By all. And I fucking love his YouTube. It's intro. incredible to see the effort developers put into prioritizing people who often go he seems ignored, like a good guy. sharing their work with as many people as possible. And that's why we love being able to show our gratitude to those who go above and beyond each year, discovering new and creative methods to encourage inclusion. Here are the nominees. <laughs> Innovation and accessibility presented Stop by the board of Anyway, the, the reason I don't like players will be able to Imagine Dragons sign is because their music just seems like the most generic, dumb, just nonsense I've ever heard. But again, I do think that a lot of people hate them just because they're popular. I've said this before on stream. I feel like a lot of people got on Amy Schumer just because she was successful. And the, the whole stealing jokes thing, I don't know about that. Maybe that's true. I don't know enough about it. People shifted on Amy Forza Schumer Horizon immediately, bro. It was crazy. She deaf stole jokes? Tonight, yeah, I, 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 that also probably is true, and I'm not even talking about that. Game. If that's true, obviously that's shitty. But people got mad at her for doing her, like, messy woman shtick. And it's like, that's what she always did. You guys just thought it got old. Which is, like, fine, but, like, don't be mad at her for doing Thank her shtick. This when it was always the same, you know? so much to our team because everyone at Playground it Games is yeah, and that's really fine. committed to accessibility. But people were so like, she was never we funny. One of she our was. Everybody uh, thought she was funny, and then it got old and she didn't change. Around the world, Which is fine. there are Sometimes about a billion players who have some sort of you know? uh, disability that makes, I just don't makes think she's funny. a challenge for them. That's fine if you and never thought she was funny. I, think us, I just think it's weird when people turn on comedians specifically and just open the magic of video games to more and more players. You know, uh, I'd like to thank a few people. Um, I'd like to thank Alan Hartman, uh, Matt Booty, um, Tara Volker, Ben Williams. Isn't doing a shtick for too Xbox, long and bad things well for comedians. Yeah, don't camps, get me wrong. Tanya, I'm not Aaron, saying that she shouldn't have like developed um, with the times. And with that, I'll, but I'll the whole like go because it's time to wrap it up. The um, whole she was never funny. Um, blah blah blah. Just like it's not true. We she was win. very popular for a long time. Tony is taking three sips of air. There's some water in here. I'm so thirsty. I'm getting like little tiny sips. What a great sentiment. Uh, such an important word. Congratulations, guys. Uh, all right, well, joining me now is Simon Vicklin from 10 Chambers. Simon, back in 2017, we announced your studio and your first game, a GTFO, right here at the Game Awards. And we're thrilled to have you back. I understand tonight you've got this a, guy a special intense. announcement for everyone. Yes. It was a great opportunity to show off the game. And was it four years ago? Yeah. yeah. Ten chambers. And um, <laughs> something's about to happen tonight. Think, yes, right? yes, yes, indeed. Uh, the thing is, <laughs> he forgot uh, if he made we, the game or not. It helped us reach, you know, the audience for our yeah. um, extreme co-op horror Did we game. We make the yeah. game, <laughs> and uh, we thought, what better way oh, to God. announce 1.0? Yeah. We've been in early access now for two years. What better way to Poor announce 1.0 than to come back to the game awards? 
So the uh, surprise announcement is that. <laughs> what the GTFO fuck we doing? We, um, this very minute, uh, we release it right now. Someone press the button. Exactly. Back yeah. home in Sweden, someone's pressing a button right now. Amazing. And it's uh, out now. And it, there's no better time to get into GTFO yeah. than right now with 25% uh, off. And, uh, you know, the, we worked hard to make guy. the game more accessible. Yeah. Sorry, it's more accessible. And, um, yeah. Well, let's, let's take a look. We've let's got something brand new. Let's take a look at the trailer, new. yeah. All right, 1.0 GTFO. Thanks so much, Simon. Check it out. GTFO is apparently fun. I don't know anything about it. I've seen it on my Steam recommended. That's as far as it'll go. Chilling 100. Hey, Wacos. <laughs> More nightmares. You know what? He was probably fine, and then he saw that lady say Jenshin, and he got like, he was like, oh, fuck. <laughs> that could be me. Descent into a vast Go get water? I mean, the show's a, a, a over at 11. I can wait a little bit. I'll suffer. Where every I'll dehydrate a bit. Might give you one more chance. There's only one rule. Let us just get Where in and get out. Bring it what it wants. Or die. Oh. In the dark. No sudden moves. Where the monsters wait. Do you know Updog? What's up? Someone's night. Such <laughs> help. Is this killing floor? <clears throat> All we know is we'll have to work together. Is it thirty percent of die awards. together? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, there's always like ninety percent ads, but honestly, that's fine. That's kind of what I watch it for, you know. If it was, like, if it was mostly awards, it would be over in, like, an hour or two. It's fine. You know? It's not a big deal. Yeah, people watch it My for name is Mike. More. I go by Mike the Quad, and I stream on Twitch. Let's go! <laughs> I joined the military in 2008. When we came back, I was involved in a motorcycle accident. Trying to figure out how to Bless use me. the Thank controller you, without... You having any hand function. If you guys could bless me with a few uh, prime subs, that would be very much appreciated. I wholeheartedly believe it kickstarts a patient's You know, saying bless you is one thing, but Ooh. dropping a prime helps my soul from leaving my body. In some cultures, they believe that when you sneeze, it's your soul trying to leave your body. And dropping a prime gaming sub actually helps me get that in. So I would really appreciate that if you guys could do it. It's free, by the way, and the, the, the stream is literally saying it right now. Look at all this cool stuff you give me Prime Gaming, including a free sub to your favorite stream. Proud sponsor of the Gaming League. You know, just give it a thought. I don't want any lo-fi hip-hop. I hold my nose when I sneeze so my soul can't get out. You're gonna Great die. Great Shadow Legends. I mean... <laughs> you pick your champions, they're glorious, and their oh shields, my God. oh, they glisten like uh, wet otters. But the bad guys, they're Lovecraftian, they're spooky, they're um, um, big. And then you go to battle. Oh, Jeff like, Goldblum is getting the bag! And finally, your foe is vanquished, and that satisfaction is such a primal feeling. You know what, bro? Ooh. Download Raid Shadow Legends. I'm it's happy. Free I'm happy that Jeff got his... Promo. Jeff deserves it. Jeff's been flying under the radar for so long. He never gets the appreciation he deserves. Get that bag, Jeff. I need to do terrible <laughs> things again. Now we must find the prophet <laughs> and kill him. Let's go, Jeff. We finally, hunt the circle. Yes. I'm gonna support I'm Jeff by following his creator link and beating the tutorial. Wait, is this chorus? 
Oh, this looks cool. I didn't actually watch it yet. I just saw the reviews were pretty good. Ooh. Yeah, this game looks pretty cool. I can't tell what the game is. The time has come to strike. Like, you know, obviously it's a space shooter. But... Okay. PC demo available. I might try that. It looks cool. Star Fox ripoff. It's a it's a game of a plane in space, bro. Come on. Be nice. Thank you, Squid Dog. That is definitely Joel from the last humanity, whatever the cost. Bro, Xbox really put Joel in Halo and have him suck up to Master Chief. What a way to dunk on Sony. What if they just made Kratos like a sniveling coward? Master Chief! Please save us! Okay. <laughs> you are not I'll save you, Joel. <laughs> That's a very funny way to do it. Kratos is a grunt. <laughs> is the campaign good, bro? I'm thinking about getting it. I like I like this new Halo. I like Infinity a lot. Play it now with Game Pass. Oh, bro, I could just get on Game Pass, which is one dollar. Halo Infinite launched yesterday, <laughs> and I know I'm playing it this weekend, and I am excited to watch next year when Steven Spielberg's Emblem Television, Showtime, and 343 Industries bring the legendary Master Chief to life in the live-action Halo original series streaming exclusively on Paramount+. Plus. What? Here is the world premiere first look trailer. Game Pass. Please welcome the Chief Creative Officer good. from Get Epic it. Games, Donald Mustard. <laughs> <laughs> Donald Mustard. That was crazy. That was amazing. Um, all right. So making games that are original, <laughs> innovative, hair. and really push the medium forward. Bro, this is the guy with the just hair. I remember him from a few years ago. Bro, you gotta shave it. He would look good bald. He would look good bald. A clear, shared vision of what a game <laughs> can be. Come These on, nominees man. for best game direction represent what's Jeff possible said no bullying. when it You're all right. comes together. You're right. I'm sorry. You are absolutely Best game direction. Right. You have no idea what's out there. Sure, I just... Freedom. <laughs> it sounds like he walked in for his interview at Epic, but he didn't have his name ready, and he's, like, trying to do a scam, and they're like, what's your name? And he looked around, and he saw... The current president on the TV, and he said, Donald? And then he saw the lunch table, and he said, Mustard. I love that bit. Yes, the current so president awesome. when he got hired right, a year ago. And the Check award for the best bit. game direction goes to Deathloop. For direction? Yes, actually. No, that's true. That's true. That's true. No, it deserves it. It deserves it. No, no, no. That's true. That's true. No, Deathloop had a very unique shtick. Deathloop had very... It was very well designed. Should not win game of the year, though. Um, yeah, so Deathloop is my first game as a, a game director. And uh, it's also the first game that uh, uh, Sebastian and I are co-creative director for. And uh, actually, I, I don't mean that as a brag. Uh, it, it was terrifying. Uh, terrifying for us, terrifying for, for the better team. Better than Psychonauts 2. Uh, I think it's, so, it has better direction yeah, than really Psychonauts 2. To, yeah. Thank the Arcane Lyon because team, I think that uh, um, Deathloop for, had you know, a taking the leap of faith of giving their best work. Like the roguelike uh, shooter to, uh, where you, you know, have to um, perform certain things at certain times. <laughs> to make this I think it's very hard to make that work. No but I think they did something really cool. Seconds. Um, <laughs> I think they did great. You know, actually walk Damn, and, I have a Panda Global like uh, ad yeah, that comes up. Is that the first for time? The PlayStation, you believed in our vision. Uh, thank you. No, Deathloop had, had great direction. And, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, it actually, I, I have 
a lot of people to thank. But they're not going to win game of the year. Not a lot of yeah. time. Can, can we make those 30 seconds loop? A couple of times. RE8 is definitely winning okay. game of the year. Then. <laughs> okay, well, uh, I'll stop here, but just uh, 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 if you allow me a small last word for uh, Budweiser, I can't, uh, my family I can't repeat in French. What you so said. Lilia, Aya, stop. Papa, Maman, je vous aime très fort. Merci. <laughs> thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs> now it's time to take a look at some other award winners tonight. In the category of best esports uh, game, presented by Grubhub, here are the nominees. I, and the game award goes to League of Legends. Congratulations. Okay. For family I feel like they game, win every the year. I feel like they win every year. And the game award goes it to. It has to be a Nintendo game. It takes two. <laughs> Nintendo is furious. They had four Here out of the five, for and it takes game. two. That's crazy. Nickelodeon. And the game award goes to. I know it's Stripe, but I hope it's Nickelodeon. Guilty Gear Stripe. Yeah, I hope it'd be Nickelodeon. Yeah. Bro, if I'm Next, Nintendo, I'm strategy game. molding. The and the game award goes to. Inscription. Age of Empires 4. Next, the nominees for best VR AR game. Nobody played it. And the game award goes to. Why did nobody Resident play Evil Inscription? VR. And finally, your most anticipated game it's presented Ring, by Prime right? Gaming. It has to be Elden Here Ring. are the nominees. It has to be Elden Ring. And the game award goes to. It has to be Elden Ring. Elden Ring for the second year in Duh. a row. TK I said everyone, Breath of the Wild too. Our next guest I said is a little cringe. shy. If anyone in the audience has any twin blades or wing spears, I'm talking to you, Reggie. I'm going to ask that you please put those away for now. Um, let's let's bring him out here. He's a little shy, but look, everybody, it's it's my pot friend. Come on out, pot friend. <laughs> Great to see you. you got a bow tie on or something. Come on out, pot friend. Don't be shy. What? Uh, looks like he's got a, a note or something. You got a note there, pot friend? What does that say? Yeah, all right. Out now. Let's see. Let's see what this note says. Thanks, pot friend. Good evening. Please enjoy my gift. A new trailer for Elden Ring. I guess we've got another world premiere trailer. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. Trailers. Let's check it I out. I already bought your game. I already pre-ordered it, bro. If I see one Dark Soul in there, I'm going to be mad as hell. He's really trying to get Pot Friend tra trending. Pot Friend is pretty funny. But when I recall, I see it true. Hot friend. Oh fuck, I muted it. Sorry. The rune of death was stolen. Sorry. I was trying to turn it up for you. And the demigods began to fall. Starting with Godwin the Golden. Ew! Queen Marika was driven to the brink. The shattering ensued a war that wrought only darkness. The Elden Ring was broken. But by whom? And why? Sad haunted tree. Fall Guys crown cameo. <laughs> That's too many enemies, bro. I can't fight them. What could the demigods ever hope to win by boring? Excited for this. Honestly, if it was not a Dark Souls game, I don't the think people would. Stars, General Rodan. Looks like the other games, yeah. And the Blade of Mikla, Melania the Seventh. 
These two were the mightiest to remain, and locked horns in combat. Now, Elven Ring is its going to be good, and I'm sure this will be good in the context of the game, but... I don't know why this is just DS4. Yeah, but I... I it would be no victim. And so, we inhabit a fractured world. Awaiting the arrival of the Elder Lord. Unless, of course. That's kind of neat. Thou shouldst take the crown. That was kind of an interesting uh, person. Jellyfish ass lady. <laughs> I mean, it looks good. Listen, I'm going to love that game. Good. Just so. confirming the date. The same. February. <laughs> Excellent. Good to see. Amazing. I can't wait to step deeper into the world of Elden Ring uh, when it does come out in February. Tonight, we've Jelly teamed up behind. with Spotify to reveal what you're listening to every day Stop. on gaming consoles as part of Spotify's Wrapped. So what were the most listened to songs in 2021 do, on gaming surfaces? Here are the top yet. three. Rap Star by Polo G, Montero by Lil Nas X, and Mood by 24K Golden featuring Ian Dior. I don't know any Congratulations of Congratulations and make sure well, to make Montero. your Spotify rap tonight. Stick around because coming That's up, Keanu Reeves and Carrie Ann Moss so reveal The Matrix Awakens. Am I fucking old? Yeah, it's gonna happen to you too. And the Game it Awards Orchestra always. pays tribute to our Game of the Year nominees. Fuck, man. It's crazy. Everybody is excited because uh, from well, software has never missed an art direction. Go ahead yeah. and break off, old timer. You don't think I know yeah, who won. Like, you break off. From is going I to make a great game. I didn't like two. the trailer, oh, the first trailer, them. because it, it looks like another day, fucking Souls baby. game. Break like, off. it looks and you sounds exactly like to. a Souls game. Never. Obviously, it's just from trailers or whatever. It might be different, but I don't know. Bloodborne and Sekiro well, were unmistakable, respect. you know? Respect. But seriously, break off. I fell into games and I lived and breathed them for so long. Silk Song will never. Come I just out. never knew that it could be a job that I could be good at. I'm Anissa Sanisi. <laughs> Don't be surprised if Death Loop wins game of the year. And I'm a UI UX no designer way. in video games. No, it's definitely Hi. RE8. Hi, how are you doing? I would bet my house on I RE8. I was born and raised in Malaysia, but I came I would to the bet UK my house on at RE8. age 19. If you're a minority working in video games. It's you R.E.A. Kind of go through life for sure. Feeling like you're an imposter. For sure. 20 gift subs? No, because nobody else is going to take me on that bet. So you I guys all say what you'll do, it, but you won't. Program. Limit Break is aimed at underrepresented people working in the UK game industry. You won't do it. Hi. I was wondering if you can help me out. Let's take just bet your house on not death loop. People just really want <laughs> I don't know who else is, would win it. And be a part if, of the if, if R.E.A. doesn't win it, I don't know who else does. wants to make video games should be able to make video games. I don't think so. What's up, everyone? I'm Cindy Goodman, and I'm about to step into the fear truck to play some Resident Evil 4. I am <laughs> terrified. Okay. I'm excited. What is RE4 VR like? <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> the fear truck. <laughs> okay, that's not part of the game. <laughs> <laughs> Can I go in the fear truck? I want to go in the fear truck. How do I buy my own fear truck? Oh, Nintendo will continue to have games. Nintendo has... <laughs> the Switch has games, and it will always have games. By the way, I got bored of Mario Rabbids. I played it, and I... Oh, dude. You guys can't see it. It literally says the sequel to Breath of the Wild. <laughs> That's funny. That's funny. That's very funny. This is preceding an announcement? It's not. Nintendo doesn't have it. Nintendo would never do this at Game Awards. They would just do their own thing. Not award-winning games, though. True. Good point. Bro, they had four out of five of the family games, and they lost all of them to a $20 indie game. <laughs> Man, that's tough. That's tough. 
The Kirby game does look good. This dude playing with bots. What the heck? AI enhanced upscaling? <laughs> I don't know what that means. I thought it was going to be like a cloud thing, but... Knack 3. <laughs> a gritty reboot. Off planet. Okay. Don't know those studios, but... Alright. I'll give it up. Hey everyone, my name is Jatubo. My go-to is probably going to be It Takes Two. Hi everybody, my what? pick is Psychonauts 2. Going to have to give it to Ratchet and Clank Rift Apart. It's Why? It's a joyride of fun from start to finish, and that's hard to beat. I don't know anybody that likes Ratchet and Clank for Game of the Year, huh? Why didn't they ask that me? That was a look at which Game of the Year nominees Why didn't they YouTube ask me, and fans bro? want to see win later I tell tonight. Them. We'll find out if they are right when we present Game of the Year. Oh, Every man. year at the Game Awards, we try to find games that push the medium forward in new and unexpected ways. This game comes from Embark Studios in Sweden, a new team of veteran developers. Sweden? Their first game brings together thrilling multiplayer PvE action, a next-generation physical sandbox, and incredible visuals to create a truly dynamic player experience. Here's the reveal, complete with real gameplay. Why do you say it like that? With real gameplay. All right. Huh? Who's there? There is no way to hide. Kings, barons, queens. We give them different names. <laughs> real analyze. Same. Nexon? Who's Nexon? I don't know who sky. they are. This is our home. Our Maple Story? Of resistance. What? This is where the brave meets the bold. Okay. We will not die in the shadows. Maple Story, uh, gritty reboot. By the way, the clock says lead. Little gamer reference for any gamers in the audience. If anybody knows what lead is. Showtime. Isn't this like mad DMCA? I think this song is like very popular. Watch it. Scout ahead. What is the What's the game? You fight robots. You owe me one. In a space like environment. Bot is fucked. I, bro, this is for us. You guys got to be here during the real stream. And so you deserve to see it. Okay. New contact. Breaking orbit. Southern Rust Belt. They will the live experience. Dude, this is long. The game looks great. I mean, I actually kind of dig it. I just, I'm sick of fighting alien robots. Resist. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Four player co op shooter, by the way. Lock it in. I like it. Yeah, I like the vibe to it a lot. I, I think it I think it looks good. I think it looks really cool. But that uh That was incredible. And now we have two special guests joining us for a very special moment. Carrie Ann, Keanu, welcome. I'm sure you guys recognize uh, this uh, iconic scene moment, right? Jeff, thank you. It's good to be here at the Game Awards, and yes, this is one of the scenes that made The Matrix feel so groundbreaking. Oh. Perhaps inspired <laughs> I thought he was talking about Cyberpunk. Video games <laughs> I was too. like, I don't remember that. Oh, I see. Yeah. I get it, yeah. Like The Matrix. Impressive. That should look like The Can Matrix. Can you still do that? Absolutely not. 
But I can in the Unreal Engine 5. <laughs> I believe everyone here is expecting to see something new, so here's a never-before-seen look at the Matrix Resurrection. It's exclusively for the Game Awards. 2021! Let's roll the clip. Track until... That's the hard part. My fucking bounties don't track until a little bit. It takes a while. I don't know why. Guys, the Matrix Resurrections Time is fly. here. Uh, I'm going to tell you all about it. In a second. Oh my god, what if I, I miss the, the game awards? Yeah. The, uh, the, here we go. Uh, the Matrix I'm Resurrections. Fine. Watch the Matrix Resurrections at theaters and on HBO Max the same day. Plus, you can discover all new originals on HBO Max. Here's the trailer for Matrix Resurrections, which is happening right now. Plus, all new se- Fuck! Fuck! Plus, all new series! All new series! Oh my god. Okay, like I can't. That. I can't do. I can't do this. I can't do this. I have to. Maybe they're not presenting anything important. My bounty hasn't even started tracking yet. It hasn't even started tracking. Okay, we're gonna. We're gonna. As I soon mean, as it starts tracking, I have to jump. Which the line between the physical and virtual. As soon as it starts tracking, I have to jump. Blurry. Okay. And with interactive storytelling reaching stunning levels of fidelity, maybe it's fair to ask, what Wait. is a game? What is a movie? Just wait. Over 20 years ago, <laughs> they the said Matrix it, by the way. pushed the boundaries of filmmaking and wait. visual effects. They did not show Silk Song. We couldn't have imagined did not. where the state of the art would be today with photorealistic digital humans in Why virtual sets. To push the limits, once again, we decided to team up with Epic Games. And now we are proud to bring you tonight's final world premiere at oh the Game God. Awards 2021. I'm going to miss it. I'm going to miss it. Of the Matrix Awakens. Oh, never mind, but it's Unreal Matrix. Unreal Engine 5. Okay, it's fine. Experience, experience, experience. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. I'm waiting for it to track. I'm waiting for it to track. I'm waiting for it to track. It's a Matrix game. It's fine. It's fine. It's a Matrix game. Don't worry. Just wait. Hi. I'm it's Thomas about the pop. Anderson. Like many of you, I it's work the with pop. computers. It's about the pop. But computers are also mirrors. Reflecting back who and what we yep. are and the choices we make. He's right. The worlds we build. Don't leave. Guys, we don't know what the game of the year is yet. You still got it. Like riding a bike, they say. Oh, that looks pretty good. That game actually looks pretty good. That actually looks very good. Oh, shit. Oh god damn it! Oh yeah. Okay, it started track. All right, we'll check it out in a minute, guys. Don't worry. We're gonna pause this. We're gonna pause this just for a moment, you guys. The Matrix me. Resurrections. Oh, uh, it's in theaters and on HBO Max the same day. Plus, you can discover all new originals on HBO Max. You can, you guys, look at HBO Max. Look at all these great series and premieres you can find on the, the HBO Max, including Matrix Resurrections. Can't believe it. Oh my goodness, you can, it's in theaters on day one and also on HBO Max the same day. All these new originals too in theaters on HBO Max. Guys, HBO Max, incredible value. It's fantastic. Uh, you should always check it out. Uh, Matrix, Matrix Resurrections, uh, The Righteous Gemstones, 8-Bit Christmas, Sex Lives, Lives of College Girls. So important to check out these Max originals. Check it out, everybody, on HBO. Okay, we're done. We're done. We're done. We're done. We're done. We're done. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's not my fault. Jury's X and ass. All right, they're playing the music. Okay. Okay. They're playing the music. We made it. We made it. Dude, I love the game of the year medleys. You almost fucked it. Bro, it's so annoying. It really is because this happens all the time. I go to try to do a bounty and then it just doesn't pop. I hit the button and it doesn't do anything. We missed Silk Song. No, you didn't. You definitely didn't.
I can't even get excited for this because I know it's not going to be Psychonauts. I'm not even happy about it. Like I, it's not Psychonauts. Also, Psychonauts theme isn't even great. They have such better songs in the game, you know? I don't feel like any of these games had great themes, actually. Like, all the way across, you know? Oh, is the stream dying? Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, sorry, sorry, sorry. Okay, okay, okay. We're good, we're good, we're good. Okay, refresh, refresh. We're good, we're good. Phew! Sorry. Oh, shit! Alright, there was one good theme. There was one good theme this year. One good theme. electric guitar just for this. Deathloop was good. It was a good game. Metroid Dread was also a good game. RE8 was a good game. Psychonauts 2 was a good game. Ratchet Clank was okay. I would bet fucking car on RE8. Truly. Deathloop sucks. No, it doesn't. It's fun. Is that Neil Druckmann? Not Neil? Okay. <laughs> Oh, it is the. Why is he presenting? What is he doing here? That was fantastic. A fitting way to honor the very best of the year. Let's hear it one more time Last for the Game winner, Awards Orchestra. I guess. Oh, I thought he was going to say, let's hear it one more time, and then they would start playing again. <laughs> Goodbye. And finally, congratulations to all of tonight's nominees. All pretty incredible games. And the 2021 Game of the Year is... It's RE8, bro. It takes two. And the that stage, uh, 2017, uh, uh, saying fuck the Oscar, and, and uh, now, uh, actually, in a way, the Oscars got fucked because the Game Awards is getting way better. So, <laughs> I want to. I know there are 30 seconds. I'm going to be extremely fast, so I want to thank my. Uh, uh, let me see. My 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 beautiful team for a fantastic world. Obviously, without them, I can't do anything. Uh. And also, I want to say also, I want to uh, give this award to my daughter, Mio. And my soon-to-come daughter, Zoe, it's so nice to have children. I'm surprised how much you love them. If you don't have children, go get them. I mean, this is the best thing <laughs> that can happen. True. Thank you again. True. I'm really proud. I'm shaking. Look at me, man. This is like a big, big moment I love me. this guy. And He's very funny. You're a big inspiration. Thank you. Thank you. I mean... Listen, It Takes Two is a very good game. Congratulations. It was a fantastic game. Joseph Ferris. Oh, uh, All right, well, what did you think of the winners tonight? Did your favorite game win? If not, post your thoughts with a YouTube short and let us know who got shorted tonight. Oh, my Thank God. <laughs> they turned it into content. We'll see That's why. Summer, summer Game Fest. Such a pleasure that we got to do this. That's why. 
Oh, they made it so now you can tweet it. Hashtag got shorted. They want content. Hashtag engagement. Oh, okay. Got it. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to harass him. <laughs> this, is the hara this is the song I play when I harass people. I'm going to I'm going to do this when I harass people on the internet. <laughs> I'm going to harass people on the internet. Uh wow. This game awards was AI generated. Yeah, I, uh, I don't know. That's weird. That is very strange indeed. I, um, I don't know. Hold on, I'm trying, I'm going to limit bandwidth on my download so it doesn't eat up my whole thing because I'm trying to download a game. We'll do this. Okay. No, I mean, so RE8 didn't win anything, right? Damn, dude. That's crazy. I, uh, I mean, like, here's the thing. It Takes Two is very good. Like, I liked it a lot. But also, I don't, I don't think I ever thought it could win. Does that make sense? Like, I feel like a part of me was also like, I don't think this will ever happen. You know what I'm saying? It was flawless, just not innovative. Yeah, that's a good way to put it. It Takes Two was, like, amazing all the way through. But it was also, like, a 10-hour game, so it's kind of short. It's, it's kind of simple in a lot of ways, which is good. It's for the better that it's that way, because the point is that it's accessible. But, like... Huh? That's so weird. That's so strange. Hold on, I keep upping the amount. I want to see what point my stream dies. Oh, found it. Found it. <laughs> Wait, maybe not. Wait. 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 <laughs> maybe not. Okay. Think we're good. I'm happy for him. I mean, like, uh, yeah, I good for him. He made a very good game. Um, I don't know. I, I, I'm happy, I guess. I can't believe that, uh, that it won, though. Isn't that so weird? RE8 got robbed. I, did RE8 win anything? That was the dog ending of the Game Awards. Yeah, I. that's... Huh. It won the VA? Oh, yeah, the I forgot about that. I, I'm not, like, upset. I'm more stunned. Kony is like, I want a multi-million dollar company to win. No, not really. It's just, like... It's weird. I didn't want REA to win, really. No, I didn't want it to win, but I thought it was going to. You know what I mean? I thought it was a lock no matter what. Um, huh. It's definitely a what champ. It's it's a fat what champ. Thank you, Kipcom. It was a weak year. I don't think any of them stood out. Yeah, this year I don't think was all that, that s stellar. Like... The way that I, I described it in a lot of different places is, like, I think this year was amazing because it had so many 8 out of 10s, but it had no 10 out of 10s. Does that make sense? Yeah, it's all 8 out of 10s. There were no 10 out of 10s, which is, like, fine. That's a good year. That's better than other years that don't have anything, right? But it is weird that that's how it went this year. Um, It Takes Two was a nine, and that's why it won. Malin, I never finished It Takes Two. 
But I think part of that is because it, it sucks playing down here because I have it on PC. So she would have to come down here and wait to get set up. Like, my desk is set up in such a way that it's only, uh, that it only really works for one person. But I'd say Dread is a 10 out of 10, just tr very traditional. I, I mean, Metroid by its nature is always going to be divisive, right? Because there's always backtracking. You can't avoid it. The, the game is designed for that. So I think no matter what, some people are not going to like it as much. Um, Coney, are you going to play Rumbleverse tomorrow? Maybe. I was actually trying to get people together for Mario Party tomorrow, but I might get on some Rumbleverse. You feel me? Let me look. I signed up for it. Let me make sure that I'm 100% signed up. Uh... Because I want to try it. Although I'm probably just going to be sad because it does absolutely seem like another one of those damn games that like it's going to come out and it's going to be dead in a week because nobody's going to play it. All right, I'm in. I am enrolled. Are you going to play Matrix? I don't know. I don't know. I wanted to watch more of that fucking trailer, but my bounty didn't pop, which was so annoying. I don't know why it does that. When I try to pop my bounties now, it just sits there for, like, a minute. And I don't know why it takes that long. I even wrote them about it. I'm like, hey, why is this happening? They're like, yeah, we'll look into it. And then they didn't look into it. <laughs> this is the longest commercial I've ever sat through. I mean, yeah, but it's always commercials, right? That's, like, the point of this stuff. It's always going to be commercials. It's reveals, you know? The Rumbleverse trailer looked like the Knockout City trailer. Yeah, it was basically the same thing. Like, one-to-one. -one. So, I don't know. None of those trailers got me excited at all. Maybe I'm just getting older. And I don't like video games anymore. I don't know. That's tough. What's your game of the year? Psychonauts. By a mile. But again, that's likely... Because I, uh, I have a strong connection to the game. I really like the first one, so. Alright, hold on. I'm gonna try unlimiting my bandwidth. Let's give this a shot. Three, two, one, go. Stay with me. Stay with me. Stay with me. Don't leave. Don't leave. Look at this. Phenomenal cosmic power. Look at this shit. Look at this speed. Look how fast, bro. Look how fast. <laughs> it's coming. Look at the bandwidth. Look at it. I can't show you what I'm downloading. Analyze the bandwidth. Look and be amazed. At the speed of which I can download. 25 megabytes per second. The fastest you've ever seen. <laughs> Show us the game. No. <laughs> I can't. You'll see it in three minutes, maybe. <laughs> Poor stream. Shut up. If too many people leave, I can't show you the game. <laughs> It'll have to wait for React Wars on Sunday. By the way, React Wars is Sunday. Uh, 7.30 p.m. is when we usually start the stream, so be here for that. Um, I am in charge of the YouTube all next week. Um, so Vince is going on vacation. So we'll see. Uh, yeah. It's multiverses? It's not multiverses. I can't stream multiverses. <laughs> how does, how do the pixels look? How do the pixels look? Pretty good. What if I were to do this? And, uh, let me see. Bit rate. Number go down. How about now? How's it look now, everybody? <laughs> How about now? Analyze. <laughs> How's it? How do I look? Huh? Pretty good. Fix the stream. 
<laughs> We're really struggling. <laughs> okay. All right, I'm back. All right, all right, I put it back. I put it back. I put <laughs> Say that again. Wait, did I did are we that slow? Dude, I talked about React Wars like three minutes ago. That's insane. We've been talking. That. <laughs> I was just talking. Dude, I talked about the Vitz vacation like 10 minutes ago. Oh my god, you guys are living in the past. Holy shit. That's insane. You guys are so far behind. I just keep buffering. <laughs> 55 seconds. <laughs> 55 seconds. Don't worry. 30 seconds till stream fix. <laughs> Don't worry. We're good. Okay. All right, here we go. 20 seconds. 20 seconds. 20 seconds. 10 seconds. Hold on. Five seconds. And we're back. And we're back. Welcome yeah! back, everybody. Hello. Unlimited bandwidth. Coney looks <laughs> 10 years older. Old 40-year-old right. boomer ass. All right. And you're welcome for scoring React Wars all season. Thank you very much. I might unionize the mods since Lud pays his. Well, uh, now hold on a minute, play. I don't have the YouTube money. Watch the viewer count drop. It's been at 1528 since before all the, sh all the tomfoolery. I want to see how far it goes down. Oh, yeah, you guys are late. You guys are very late. We're so far behind now. Are we caught up? Press 1 when you hear this. Press 1 when you hear this. Oh, you can hear it now? Okay, we're caught up. We're caught up. Okay. All right, we're good. We're good. We're good. <laughs> All right, let's watch the viewer drop. I want to see. I want. I need to see the number change. Fifteen twenty-eight. Let me make sure I have the right info. Fifteen twenty-eight. Subula, you promised. Oh, I did, didn't I? Hold on. Hold on. This always takes forever to update. I'll just go to my actual stream. Hold on. 1528, bro. Everybody stuck around. Uh oh no. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> what happened? Oh no. Okay. All right. Well, now that everybody's left anyway. Oh, wait, I have another idea. Hold on. Guys, if you're pressing... <laughs> if you're still typing one, please refresh. You are very uh, far behind. <laughs> okay. 
Okay. All right. Uh, let me see. Hold on. Give me one second. One second. Okay, hold on. Okay. <laughs> this is so stupid. This is so stupid. This is so dumb. This is so fucking dumb. I just had an idea. Okay. All right. Uh, hmm. Okay. Uh, it is a dark and stormy night. Uh, you are walking along the countryside. Um, lit only by the light of the moon. It's a full moon. Uh, the clouds, uh, the clouds converge upon your path. And they, uh, block off your only source of light. And you can't see the moon shining behind it anymore. And so you continue walking until you come across a dark and foreboding castle and you go inside the castle uh, looking for shelter from the rain and as the door slams behind you seemingly uh, moved by forces you cannot comprehend all the castles all the all the candles in the castle alight at once and at the top of the banister you see a shadowy figure who beckons to you almost as if he knows you and then you black out. And then something occurs. Stream Deck died. is by 100%ing Twitch Primes. At 50 cents, I will flip the castle upside down. If we can get to 1800, I will flip my castle, and so you will be able to see my true form. Yes, it's true! For only five, for only $250, can see the castle in its truest element. Thank you, your kindels, and to architect for fight for the subscriptions. It only takes 100 subs to put me back into my coffin. I have been asleep waiting for tonight for 5,000 years, and now I'm back to terrorize. Twitch dot television. <laughs> and if you can actually fight against me for free, if you have, if you, are there two organs? I I feel like I have the song playing twice. I think it's because of my stream deck. WHICH IS HAUNTED! 
Very scary! Yes, indeed! Yes! Very scary indeed! Thank you, Mousif, for the five tier ones! And I just realized I'm not going to know when to start this because the height train was four hours ago. So I guess we're stuck here. <laughs> Until the next height train. <laughs> oh, <laughs> that is quite unfortunate. Quite unfortunate indeed. But it is very fortunate that I have come back from my slumber at the perfect time to find all of you to give me your tier one subscriptions for five dollars or free with Prime Gaming, which you may have and not even know it. You might have a free subscription in your box and you're not even using it. Oh, the horror. How truly terrifying to see that. Oh, no, what a terrible thing to happen. Well, uh, I, I think it's been five minutes, which means it's time for the end of my reign of terror as I come back every 1,000 years. Thank you, Kaveji and Kaiser. One, two, three subs! E. Compton has given like 50. Jesus. Sebula lost us another 150 viewers. That's usually how things go, I think. Yet, I think when this happens, you know it's time to turn the stream off because everything that is good on the stream has already happened. We are now in the downturn. Ah! <laughs> Okay, so now I believe it is time for me to go back into my slumber and, and be laid to rest once again. Thank you all for joining me on my, my reign of terror once again. I will see you in another 1,000 years. Goodbye. Oh. What? There are two of them? What? What? I can't stop it! And now I can't get it. Wait. Wait. Give me a second. God damn it, dude. God damn it. Okay, that was the worst thing we've ever done on the stream. That was the worst thing <laughs> that's ever happened. <laughs> okay. That was... <laughs> Jesus Christ. My stream deck died. And then it played the fucking music twice, and you guys heard it twice. And then I couldn't change the fucking, the lighting to make it less scary. 
So I'm going to lose more viewers because <laughs> everybody's scared. Oh, my God. Okay. All right. Subula was, tr was triumphant. We lost. Well, you'll get him next time. I have a feeling you'll get him next time. Incredible bit. Not tonight. <laughs> Maybe some nights, but not tonight. <laughs> oh, my God. These are drenched. Holy shit. There was a point where it was so loud we could barely hear you. I don't know why it played twice. It played two times. And I don't know why. Okay. Okay. <laughs> My teeth hurt. Ow. Did Subula steal your hat? I don't... I wasn't clear on the flipping the castle CTA. <laughs> I literally had that idea right before doing it, and I was like, I'm going to put that up there. But it's better with the hype train. Ow. Ow. The teeth made me want to gag. <coughs> oh, my God. Okay. All right. Ugh. My lips hurt. Okay. Ow. Hold on. Okay. <laughs> what a mess. Jesus. Okay. Sorry, I was trying to decide. Should I do this now? Because I'm probably going to stream tomorrow. You kept a promise. That's all that matters. Yeah, don't say I never do anything for you. That was that was not for me. That was only for you. That had not I I derived no joy out of that. Not at all. Ow. That was not for me. Yes, it was. It was for you specifically. Whether you enjoyed it or not, I don't know. <laughs> Okay. Mm. My fucking teeth hurt. Woke up your child for subs. Oh, God, yeah. Mallory told me to be quiet, and I didn't do that. So I'm probably in trouble. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> oh, no. All right. I'm good for tonight. I think we're going to call it for tonight. I was going to play something else, but I think tonight's good. I think I'll do it tomorrow. I think tonight's the night. Bro, that's so weird. The fact that it, it takes 2-1. I still, like, I can't get over that. That's so bizarre. Genshin Impact is still trending, by the way. It was trending before, but it's still trending now. That's crazy. Okay. Uh, I'm going to go to bed. I will see you guys tomorrow. I think I'm going to do an extra stream uh, tomorrow since I was gone for so long. So, um, I want to play Mario Party tomorrow. Let me see if I can get a group together. We'll see. Yeah. All right. Go watch Connor. I'll see you guys uh, tomorrow, most likely. I mean, if I don't, then I don't. But if I don't do it tomorrow, I'll do it su uh, Saturday. I'm definitely going to do it at some point. So. Uh, React Wars is Sunday. More stuff coming. Blah, 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 blah. All right. We'll see you guys soon. Goodbye. How I love this pretty bed. Now I'll rest my weary head. Good night. And wait for the ads. And...